Okay, I'm not quite like ready to start right now, but I'm seeing some divinity discussion on YouTube and everyone who is saying that a party full of foreign divinity is easier, you're just wrong. Divinity, there is a trait called Lone Wolf that makes a party with two be a lot stronger than a party with four. Sorry, it's just true. For anybody, because it makes your characters OP. Very OP. Intuitive that two party members would be stronger than four, but it is how it is in Divinity, and because of that reason, some people, when I was starting to play my Baldur's Gate with less party members, they thought that that was easier than doing um, a full group because that is what actually happens in, in this game. is going well we'll continue that tomorrow okay, let's let boo sleep <clears throat> hi 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 did you guys have a good day lots of happy to see you hi 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 hey i love bunny's lua and oh gameplay lua high five i forgot to put my earbuds 
Oh, thank you. Thank you. B? Oh, Mrs. B here. Hi, B. Oh, so good to see you. Um, give me, give me one second. I'll just put my earbuds. One second. Dine your face, dine your face, dine your face, dine your face. Oh gosh, Rani, honey, thank you. Summer chilling. Mwah. Thank you for the two months of support. Wait, where did I put my headphones? Okay, okay, okay. Did you guys have a good day? Hi, hi. And <laughs> Mr. Spreeber, yep, he's very talented. He's such a good boy. Uh, you're welcome. Spaceman, boo found love. <laughs> but 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 divinity is I also find that divinity is harder in the beginning than it is later on because later on first I'll have remembered a lot more to the game because right now it has been five years since I played it so there's a bunch of things that I'm still you know struggling because I simply don't remember a lot of mechanics and especially because I'm also used to 5th edition, Dungeons and Dragons. But as I am remembering Divinity. the mechanics Shop. of Divinity, it's gonna be a little bit better. Love you, Lua, Lua, love, love. Yeah, most builds start popping off in Act 2, right? It's true. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mina, thank you, thank you for the two months. Mwah, thank you, thank you, Elemental. Mwah, thank you, thank you, Ronnie Zap. Mwah. So, uh, I'm playing as main character Fina. I never did that before. So, let's see how it goes. Uh, cry, thank you so much. We're here two six months. This is so kind of you. Thank you, thank you, thank you so much. Thank you. Yeah, I kind of messed up the builds of my characters in the beginning because, again, it has been five Shop. years since I played. And I can't get it since uh, until I get you the ship, Lady Vengeance. Good evening. Hi. Hi, Bree. Hi, Brian. Shop. Hey, how are you doing? Thank you. Thank you. Hi, Lua. You look wonderful today. Oh, thank Lua you. Dance. Thank you. Thank you for the eight months. So, so, the thing about Divinity is that it's very different. Oh, God. Ha! <laughs> Poor idiot. <laughs> that was even easier than I thought. <laughs> Shiva, thank you so much for your one year of Poor support. Idiot. Thank you. <laughs> oh. <laughs> uh, Shane. <Poor> idiot. <laughs> play Divinity 2 first. It's a newer game, and if you like, you can always go back to Divinity 1. Poor or... idiot. I love the <laughs> Divinity song. Poor idiot. <laughs> <Ha>! Stupid. <laughs> Poor idiot. <laughs> that was even easier than I Shabu. thought. I hate ha! this game. Um, I have a problem. <laughs> Dr. Hagen, thank you so much for the two months. I feel like this game is very humbling. How the fuck will I resurrect him? Hold on. One of my characters died. <laughs> that was even easier than Funny. I thought. Rui Nicola, thank you so much for the two months. Did you guys have a that good day? That was even easier. Oh, so see. happy to see you. <laughs> Poor oh, hey. Idiot. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> good morning. High five. 
I don't know. I'm, I'm literally being called a stupid and idiot. I I. That's bad, man. I think I'm just going to know of three characters. <laughs> That's it. Mm, thank you so much for the prime. Thank you. Okay, so my main character, I'm playing as Fane, and we are undead. So I actually heal by taking poison damage. So I, I'm just going to make this poison goo and sit here for a bit. So I heal. Hold on. Give me one second. Did you guys have a good day? Hey, hey. Yeah, I don't know why you guys are spamming gambling right now, because I'm right here. Oh, yeah, I forgot about the bad brow. I don't know, this is fun. This is fun. Bad road is just a button. Being... Hitting yourself with your own stuff and walking a oh, poison pool uh. that you just created. I was having a good day until I opened this game. Are you having a good day yet? Hi, Hanjo. Hey, Zanary Tactrix. Bonnie, Zazamiya. Remember Quincy? Daryl? Hi, hi. So good to see you guys. Thank you. Thank you. Um, This is fine. I cannot... Mysterious room. No, no, it's not Neo. It's not Neo, no. Bunny. Bunny. Wait. You guys literally prefer gambling to saying hi to me and sharing about your day? What? What is this absurd? I think I would disable this gambling command. It's just too much. What is this? Hi, fellas caught. No, I just didn't see because of the gambling spam in chat. Hey, buddy Chillaloo. Hey, the problem is the spam. Fellas caught, how are you doing? Hey, Puffy. Hey, Midnight. Hey, hey, Azoka. I should really disable the gambling command while I'm... Yeah, because then I just lose the shot. Hey, good morning, Mr. Smiles. Okay, are you guys feeling low energy today? Is that the problem? Okay, 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 okay. Okay, okay, okay. So, 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 with me, okay? With me. Just so we have a better day, we'll knee a little, okay? Just, just let's knee together just so we have a good day. Knee, 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 knee. Come on, come on, come on. Knee, knee, knee. Come on, come on. Hype it up. Hype it up. Come on, come on. Knee. Okay, okay, come on, come on, come on. Don't be a little horse. Just, just do it. Come on. Thank you, thank you. Me, me, me. There we go. I can start. Okay. There was literally an NPC trolling me, calling me a fucking idiot and stupid. And you guys were gambling, chat. You should be making fun of me, calling me stupid as well. Join the NPC. You know? Come on, let's go. Who we'll killed this NPC? Well, I killed three copies of him, and then another copy of him summoned, and and called me dumb and stupid. I feel like killing him is not is not what it is. And now I'm frozen because I opened a fake door. I'm fucking stupid. Let it go. No, I can't. Okay. This is not... Yeah. I'm... I don't know. You see yourself in the mirror. It's quite a sight. Mm. <laughs> the Jack. Fast yeah. Tight. Good, good Jack now. Okay, so the... the this door is locked. Oh god. Oh god, I remember this arena. I don't think that's a good thing. And now I got a poison. Oh god. Wait. I got... 
There must be something in here, right? There must be. This door is also fake. Hold on. What's this statue? Can I touch it? You come to find. You come to search. But you won't find the way. A pity. Well, how can you be so certain? Brachus has willed it. Trompdoy must abide. You have met the unfortunate guardian of this vault. Oh. So, so Trump is the guardian. I have had the displeasure, of course. Judge him with a forgiving heart. Fate has been unkind to him. Forgiving heart? For calling me stupid and laughing at me? Putting pranks at me? Gosh. Mines. Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. Sorry for the gambling. I just lost three milk rots the other day, Lou. A sad. No, that's okay. It's okay. Just, you know, you can come and gamble when I'm offline. Yeah, you can. And that's okay, Valska. I don't have to say sorry. I'm just saying, it's just that sometimes when I'm trying to talk with you guys, it's hard for me to, to, to gamble. Uh, I'm loving Divinity. I love how... I know that fly, right? Hi? Hi? So it just gets me to lose the messages of people in chat, you know? So sometimes it becomes too much spam. That's why I ask you guys to not gamble when I'm I'm here. If I'm EFK, it's okay. Unless if you never want me to respond to your messages, then yeah, sure, go ahead. Then I also stop looking at chat and just play the game. Because then there was nothing worth seeing for me in chat. Is that what you want? That's what you get? Yes, this is trash. I don't have a sharp knife, but I have this hairbrush, and I'm not afraid to use it. Uh, no, I didn't get Fane's mask. I had it, but I lost it. <laughs> Patrick, thank you so much for the two months of support. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Do you wish to move forward? Uh, sure. Listen closely and make your attempt. Okay. Brachus is a bloody, rotten, thieving, very, very awful fellow. Some even call him a cur. A cur is... What the fuck is a cur? Oh, fuck. Oh, thank you so much. Thank you, Cla... Chuck Laser. Is that what your name is? I love that. A cur. Wait. Very awful rotten. Rotten, bloody awful. Very bloody awful. Bacchus is a bloody, rotten, tiefling, very, very awful fellow. He's out of these! Brachus is a... This is a grammar trick. Brachus is a bloody... I think tree, maybe? Hold on. Maybe one. No, there is no plugin to vote in this game, so you need to vote uh, the old way. Hold on. Jesus. Um. I think I have brain rot right now. Uh. Fucking hell. I think. Uh, I think. Maybe tree. Shit. One? Most people are saying one. It's about... Brachus is a bloody rotten tiefling. Very blood... Very, very awful... Fellow. It's... I think you guys are right. I think it's one. 
Either you're very good at guessing or the slightest bit clever. Let's find out for certain. Oh! Shit! Rumble's Universe, those are very different games that came uh, 20 years apart, mo more or less. It's, it's hard to compare games that come so many years apart because, you know, games are a new thing. Listen closely and make your attempt. Okay. Source is a scourge, a devil, a misery, a blight, a hex, a curse. And yet, the cure is... A hex, a misery, a blight, a curse. Perhaps you're not totally incapable after all. Or maybe oh! Softboy told you the answers, is that it? Is he hoping you'll... Uh, it's funny because even when I pick the right stuff, the game calls me stupid. Like, the game has no faith in me. Like, this game is literally made to take the player and humble it down. It doesn't matter in any case. The path is open. Go freely. Can I ask you further questions? I know little, but you have proven yourself no, no, a knowing you. traveler. Thank you. Thank you. I will answer what I can. Okay. What What do you mean you say that Rumboy was kept here by Bracus Rex? Bracus Rex has charged him, tried him, convicted and punished him. I know not the crime, but he has been sentenced to remain in this vault for all time okay. and to prevent others from entering it. Okay, so Bracus Rex is a very awful guy. So it's likely that this Trump boy that is making fun of us, he could have been a good boy. Trump boy was and is a creative man. He yeah, very petty seven? magic in his day. But this he has used to carve this place out from a simple vault, myself included. Okay, what do you mean about cure to source? Bracus Rex discovered the way. This he researched here upon this isle. He could remove the source from any creature or individual. I saw the staffs he used myself. They were most impressive. Okay. Hey, level up! Let's go! Well, I only have a problem, though. Well, if only I only had one. Thank you, Rambles. Uh, no, Brax is not a good boy. Wait, will him be missing out in experience? Because I left him dead? Because I don't have a resurrection screw right now. Oh wow. Okay. Okay, good. Yeah, I, I just don't have a resurrection screw. I don't know how I'm gonna manage. Um, Sibyl? Oh, she didn't level. So, we got... Uh, Hold on, Sibyl, Fane. We should get Persuasion on Fane. We should get uh, the Summoning. And we should get um, Constitution. What do you guys think? Probably Constitution. Ryan. I haven't finished Baldur's Gate 3, we're in the beginning of a run. But we're also playing Divinity. We'll be playing Baldur's Gate tomorrow and probably Divinity the day after. We'll play one and the other. I'm playing both. Wits. No. Uh, work no fun. No, I'm not using any of the gift bags because they disable achievements. Maybe wits. Because it gives initiative. Yeah. Okay. Now, the Red Prince, do you guys think it's worth for us to invest in Khan? Or do we keep investing? Hmm. I think it's strange for him. Okay, we also give him Warfare, and we'll give him 
I guess bartering? Yes. Uh, so my characters are kind of built like trash. But as so, soon as we can, I will respec. Hey, legendary, hey! Hey, hey, Kaladin, it's okay, we can always respec later. Hey, Johnson, hey, hey, thank you. Okay. Yeah, my characters are fine. It's no. I think I'll die here. Johnson, thank you for the four months. Thank you. Hi, Fel. Hey. Okay, so. I'm pretty sure those chests are gonna kill me. I should. I should have kept my choice. Whatever. <laughs> I have. I have played the first Divinity long ago. I have played this game too, but I forgot basically everything. It has been way too... I, per I, I, I failed the perception check in real life. Okay, let's go. Okay. I only have three characters because one of my characters died. And I have a faint memory of this place being hell. <laughs> there is a chest here. Open your eyes. Time. Panic. He's invisible. Okay. Well, it's bad that Fane acts first. Because. Hold on. Because I don't have any any surfaces to to create my minions. What do I do? Shit. Oh, this skin is not so Oh, sorry, sorry, thank you. I moved because to, cha to change. Yeah, sorry, 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 sorry. I think I need an iPhone for this. It's okay. We will use favorable, favorable wind. We'll use... Uh, uh, we'll create a turret. Possibly... Here. Okay. And then... I just let go. Wait, there's another guy there? Yeah, there's no way I would do this. Shit. There is no way I'll do this. This is a fake one. Huh? There is a guy that went invisible here. Okay, this is not great. Hold on. Okay, hold on. Hold on. No, no, I got this. God, this guy has so much armor. I should probably kill that guy that has high ground. Okay, hold on. Hey, Dr. Frey, thank you, thank you, thank you. Hold on. Happy New Year, Lua, and everyone. D. Thank you, thank you, Dr. Frey. Thank you, thank you. Happy New Year. Thank you. Thank you. Mwah. Thank you. Okay. Can we leave and come back? We are playing tactician. 
Honor mode, you can't reload like I just did. Hold on. This is really bad. This is really bad. Hold on. Puffy. I know, this game is really good. Is it okay for us to teleport out and come back in? Because we need to go... To a Madia Sanctuary. And we need to buy a Resurrection so because I think I'm Hello fucking again. his experience. What brings you here? Shit, I don't think I have money. Is there a good sex scene in this game? Yes. Yes. Hold on. I think I will sell this. Wait. Is there any way for me to select... Go in our mind. My items and send everything to Red Prince. Because Red Prince will need to... You know, maybe I should affect... Maybe I should buy the gift bags. Smoke Get a screams. gift bag that allows me Coast to just... Death. Use all my character no. skills on any character because then I wouldn't need to worry about shit like this. Yeah, what do you guys think? Please, Armadi, bless and protect you. You have nobody in your party who can pickpocket? Yeah, that's not good. I know it blocks the Steam achievements, but it's, I guess it's okay. <sighs> I don't really care for achievements. Hello again, child. What brings you here? Hmm. Because now he can sell. Smoke and screams. I don't know. I don't know. Thank you, Dr. Pope, yes. for the 13 months. Thank you. Please come back. Okay, wood chopper, plain bowl, air, fire, wind, drained wind. I think we have better armor. Okay, you see, now you're getting some money. How much to buy two? I don't have money! Sean Moore! Mwah, thank you! Oh, Divinity is a lot harder than Baldur's Gate 3. A lot harder. <laughs> Sean Moore! Mwah, thank you so much for your membership! Thank you! Yeah, the music is fantastic. Hold on. Please come back. I don't... Okay. Is this worth it? I need to stop dying. I can't afford dying. Yeah, I don't like I don't like selling things either. Oh my god. I need to steal shit. Go in on Okay. How the fuck do I get money in this game? Should I just kill everybody and rob their money? Yeah, I... Hold on. Where was the lizard? There was a sexy lizard over here? I think it's this way, right? Yeah. Buy it out, take on the word's depth, and then break the economy? I was not asking for real life advice. Where you can make and sell infinite drugs? Wait, you can sell drugs to NPCs? You can only pickpocket an NPC once? Ah, oh, thank you. Thank you, Shangor. You're so kind. Ah, oh, thank you. You're so kind. That's awful.
Panic 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 Okay, I backstab him. I'll bleed. I'll get some AP. Oh my goodness. Steal all the paintings from Fort Joy? I might have to. Because right now I don't have money for anything. Okay, this is fine. Um, we can create a... Uh, wait, did I just... E. Awful. I need to lock my bar. I need to create this minion. So, I'm a necromancer, and necromancers, depending on the... Not necromancer, summoner. Depending on the surface that you create your minion, it's gonna have different skills. So, the, the one that is infused with blood does a lot of damage. And I really like having a lot of damage. This is not even a ghost. This is like an illusion of the dude. Hold on. I would just uh, knock him down. So he doesn't eviscerate me next turn. Okay. I'll yield to Here we go. The Seville's profile picture look a little bit creepy. I should put Fane on top because he's my party leader. Hold up. But I can't because the iPhone is dead on the bottom. Shit. It's okay. It's okay. This is all fine. I forgot to infuse. Uh, Where's my minion? Why oh, he's so tiny? He needs to grow up! Yeah, Summoner is really good. I have played Divinity Original Sin before, yes, but it was... It was... Hold on, let me knock him down again. Nice. Yeah, fuck that. That's 45. Okay. Mr. Bear! Well, thank you so much for the two monks! May the bunnies be with you! Thank you! And then we just kill, and then we kill again. Hapa! Let's go! Uh, Divinity 2 is amazing. If you like Divinity 2, then, then go back to Divinity 1. You don't have to play them in order. So, we don't even get loot. For fighting this, this guy. You know, so I feel like this situation is very is very complicated because you know, it, it mostly has to do with the intentions of the people in a company. If the intentions of the people is in the co in the company is making money above all, you're probably not going to get a quality product. If the intention of a company is making a good game and it's worth sacrificing some profits for making a good game. Then you're gonna have a good game. If that makes sense. So, but 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 that's valid for anything, not only games. It could be any kind of work you do. If your intention is just profits and not the actual work itself that you're doing, the work itself is not gonna be so good. Okay, now that we have a fan, we should get XP. Yeah. Hold on. I had already talked with this guy. Okay, at least now we have a full party. I think EA... EA had like its worst times. I honestly feel like Blizzard is worse than EA now. Right? Hold on. Let's see what happens. Time. Oh, he! This guy is cursed. Hold on. The other guys are not cursed. Do you guys think I can? Okay, hold on. Let's send Sibyl. Wait. Let's take... 
I think the most important thing for me to do is to take this guy down here. Because if he has high ground, it's gonna be a lot harder for us to fight him. game is so much smarter than in Baldur's Gate. Like, the, the NPCs, they actually line up their AoEs to fuck me as hard as possible. Like, if one NPC can knock me down, they will. Open your eyes. Time to okay, he acts first. Okay. I'm gonna do better this time. Okay. We are gonna take Sibyl. And we are going to put Sibyl right here. That's okay. And then, we're going to take and create a turret here. Okay. She still jumps, but that's okay. Since I have the high ground on Sibyl, it should be easier. I think I should be able... Hold on. Can I... Can I walk here? Ben, I can. Okay. This is fine. Let's go here. This is fine. Frozen and Grease. I think Grease is actually a lot better in this game. Grease is actually good in this game. Funny enough. Okay. So, this guy... Let's focus on this guy that's tasted. Okay. We teleport to him. We'll... So elves, when they stand in blood, they heal. Ooh. Elves, they don't... When girl elves, they menstruate in this universe, they just bleed naturally because they love standing in blood. It's great. And now we stab. And we stab. And then we stab. Here we go. It's true! Hold on. Uh, oh, iPhone. I should have put the iPhone there, actually, now that I think about it. But you know what? Just so we can act this turn, we can probably just shoot this guy. The other guy was in front. Okay, something nearby? Oh, that's the guy. He's walking to us. Hold on. Wait. I can't walk? That's okay. That's okay. We'll just create our minion in this blood. And then we'll make our minion stronger. Here we go. Yeah, so, so this game has a lot of depth. Okay. Let me go... But then that guy acts next. Not if I stop him. Oh, he has. I don't think he can bleed because he's undead. Oh, high five! Let's go! We killed him! You see, even the AI is not perfect. Yeah, someone is invisible. Red Prince is dying. I cannot let anyone die. Because the cost of resurrecting NPCs is too high. Do I even have. I have no healing potions. Can I eat an apple? Honestly, it's better than nothing. Okay, we attack. And then we attack. And then we, we fortify. It is. Yeah, shield and armor is very important in this game. So he made me wet, and then he shocked my characters, so I would be stunned. 
That's how smart the AI is in this game. I've never seen any NPCs do this in Baldur's Gate. Do you guys understand what I'm saying? He literally threw a water bottle and, sh and stunned my character. I actually... I actually met the person at Larian that made the AI for this game. Uh, I, I visited Larian Studios in January. And... Uh, um, January of last year. And... Uh, and he said that sometimes the AI in this game would do... In, in, in testing, would do... Things that were so intelligent that they had to dumb it down because at principle it was so intelligent that it actually didn't look like it made sense like they had a witness uh the ai kill one of their own companions in the middle of a fight but then after thinking really hard about it it actually gave them an advantage for doing that so but but they would be so complex that you would just think that it felt like it was doing dumb things when it was doing very smart things. Uh, Galdorus, thank you so much for the two months. So, so they have to adjust for that. <laughs> uh, right now, he's the director. I don't know if he still is. But at the time, he was the director of the Quebec studio at Larian. We don't have any AP. Oh, wait, what? Why is she... Oh, this is bad. You, you see, Sabila does the most damage when she hits from behind. Show yourself. He jump. I'm fucked. Thank you so much for the two months. Mwah, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Let me ask you guys. Do you guys mind if I go back to Fort Joy and just rob everything they have in the walls and sell that stuff? Because right now my characters don't have enough skill. They just don't. This is the heart. Like I just game. cannot do like do much. And I love it. Especially since it's adult themed. Hey, hey, Kyra, thank you. Yeah, this is the hardest game. Yep. This is the hardest by far. Okay. So 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 let's do it. Uh let's go back to Fort Joy. Jesus. Uh, yeah, so, so, in January of last year, I, I, um, I was in Canada and, uh, Larry invited me to stop by their studio and I, it was actually one of the best days of my life. I'll never forget that day. Um. I got to play, uh, I, I got to play uh, Baldur's Gate 3 on, on Vita. I got to Vita test at Larian, Baldur's Gate 3. And um, I, I got to see it like the very beginning of Act 2 back in January of last year. And uh, I got to, I got to meet so many of the Larian devs and and they were so nice. My favorite thing about about that is that they were as excited to talk with me as I was to talk with them. And uh, and uh, and after they stood your clothes, that we went for dinner together. And uh, <laughs> and it was just so fun, you know. I 
there was a stupid dessert called uh, the financial the the the, the number of, the dessert sounded so dumb that we actually ordered it and it was actually so good i actually i i, I want to go back to that restaurant and and try the financial again it, it was i don't know it, 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 that day was just fantastic that day was just fantastic and and hearing in that dinner, the devs talked to me about uh, their experiences making this game. And also, but to a less extent, Baldur's Gate 3, because they were still making Baldur's Gate 3, you know? So so they talked about like some of the challenges, how how they they had a goal on the Kickstarter to, to make it fully voice acted and they didn't know how they would it, they, how they would make that you know because and and he still doesn't know how his van managed it they 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 shared so many good stories you know i i just again uh larian is the only studio that i actually got to meet to, to visit the studio and meet the devs personally like that and uh, I never seen so many passionate and excited people about what they do in one place together. They would not only talk so happily about their work, and it didn't matter what level of work they did. Everyone was excited. And uh, um, they would always say good things about Sven. They all admire Sven so much. And uh, most importantly, they admire each other's work. There was one of the devs that said that he, sometimes he would get up and stand behind the desk of one of their character designers because it was just fantastic to watch him work. And I feel like that's one of the things that allowed them to create the games that they gave us. It's because those people, they love what they're doing above anything else. And I feel like that's how you get good things done. And seeing that, it was just fantastic. It was just so freaking fantastic. I hope one day I get to go back. Gosh, I'm sorry. I just, I just, I just got like, I just got re reminded about that day. And it's just... Pulp turtle, Mwah. thank you. Are you the pulp turtle from Elden Ring? Thank you, thank you, Mwah. thank you. Uh, if you guys want, uh, on my YouTube, there is a YouTube video where I, I. I think I went in a lot more detail how that trip went. Oh my gosh, congrats. Uh, nice quad cam. Yes. Yes, quad cam. That's what I'm doing. My characters are all physical characters. Yeah. God, I, I started tearing up in my, my makeup. Hey, Legendary Drops, how are you doing? Hey, oh, hi, nice to see you. Yes, Repairman Jack, me too. I have been a, a, a fan of Larian since many years and, you know, having the opportunity to meet them. I, I, got, I got to meet them twice and they were both the top two days of my life. It was just a great time. It was just a great time. And I think that's the most important thing in a video game. I think the devs that do different things, they need... Very vexing, thank you. The, the, the devs that are making... When you make a video game, you're basically mixing a bunch of different art styles together. You're missing, uh, you're mixing um, drawing, you're mixing writing, you're mixing uh, making animations, you're mixing 
I would even add programming as an art style, even if most people don't see it like that. And you need to not only do those arts, those different areas of art very well, but you also need oh, fancy. to oh, let please. them collaborate and harmonize well. Because what is so good about Baldur's Gate 3? It feels like the entire game is good. The audio is good, the cinematics are good, the combat is good. Everything in the game is good. Everything synergizes so well. Everything, one thing does not take away from the other thing. And, and then I have a, another really good example to give. Diablo 4. Diablo 4 is the best recent example where it's not like that. Like the cinematics of that game, they're so good. But then I remember that there was a cinematic that was amazing. The father watched his son become a demon and watched you kill him. And then you kill the father. And I was literally about to cry. And as soon as this cutscene ended, the body of his son exploded and there was a lot of loot in the floor for me to pick up. And all that feeling and all that energy from that cinematic, it was gone. It just completely lost all of its meaning. And in a video game, it's very important that you do not let that happen. Because one but, but that happens when the devs don't talk with one another. That happens when, when, when there is not like a, a planning on how to make things good as they can be. Does that make sense? So it's very important that not only you work together, but you talk to each other and help each other. Uh, Okay, thank you so much for your subscription. And mwah, thank you so much for the gift of your crash. Thank you, thank you. But it's still, you know, it, it, the game needs to have a consistency or it just looks like it's all over the place. It has, it, it, it just looks unfinished, unpolished. As she catches sight of you, recognition flashes in her terrified eyes. She drops her hands from her throat and starts hyperventilating. I feel like a lot of people cannot see the story and vision behind the game very often. Not catching a game's meaning despite this. Oh, thank you, Glad. Thank you. I, 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 have, I have talked and I have uh, some game devs that, that are friends. So I, I'm actually, whenever I play a game, I, I always pay attention to all those things because I, I, I... You guys know, I love Baldur's Gate. And when I love something, I, I want to understand it. I want to know it in and out. So I have been playing video games since I'm three years old. And, and I try my best to understand and talk to a lot of people that make them because I feel like the more that I understand, the more that I can appreciate them better. I can understand why the good is so good and I can understand why the shortcomings happen. It makes a lot more sense because on a video game, my friends, nothing is random. Everything is there because somebody made it. Things are not done by accident. Everything is taught true. Because there is hundreds of very intelligent people working together. But sometimes those people, they don't work as a team. They kind of work against each other. And then things become a little bit clunky and weird. But it's our intention. I'm sorry, I talked too much. Ben, miss, you killed them! You really did. You Sab killed them! He killed them all! Happy holidays, you are here to a new year of happiness and joy. Obligatory BF babysitting fee. P.S. Uh love your Tommy Lua love. Oh, Raja, thank you so much for the seven months. Seven months of support. As I'm being called a murdered. Raja, thank you. You're so sweet and I'll keep babysitting Tommy. Lots of loot. You know what's funny, uh, Twig, but I find that Diablo 4 has a very weak uh, uh, loot system. The loot system is good until you're level 60, and after that it becomes really boring. It's like they made a really good start, but then it fell true. 
the itemization is not as good. I feel like Diablo 4 is a game that maybe in five years from now, after they worked a lot in it, it's going to be great. Because even though they, they focus on the explosion of loot, after level 60, you realize that the loot's not that great. What should I do? This woman is calling me to murder. Yeah, by a lack. Yes. But you know, by the time it's good, then nobody will be talking about it. And it's gonna die. If it ever gets there, right? Because honestly, I have no faith in Blizzard. Blizzard, Blizzard died when Activision bought it. You don't have to fear, Mira. I do not have a contract on your life. Keep him away from me! Help! Somebody! Keep him away! Stay back. Stay back. Keep that monster bed mess. A friendly freak. Do you realize that you're talking about a mod? That randomizes the NPC. Uh, I, 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 that doesn't. Uh, yeah, but you're, you're probably just making a joke, right? Tell me Stay that's back. a joke. Gosh, I don't know. You never know on the internet. I hope it's a joke. But yes. Oh, okay, okay. Thank goodness. Oh, okay. The, in the internet, you just never know because you know, in one fight, people are seriously suggesting me to use graze on the fight, and and sometimes people, do. you know, what's funny? A friendly freak. Whenever somebody says something really, really interesting in chat, I actually, I actually think about that for like weeks. It's crazy. It's crazy. <laughs> because it's so rare to see that it stands out and it's just like, wow. <laughs> But yeah, it's true. Actually, it's true. Look here, mates. A fresh face. We love fresh faces, don't we? <laughs> oh, yes, we do. <laughs> Why don't you join us in a round of cards? First hands on the house. Zalara. I don't know if Zalara is here right now, but I don't even remember what Zalara said. But in one of my playthroughs, Zalara said something in chat that was so smart. Then I was like, holy shit, that's so smart. And, and one, I never forgot Zalara's name. <laughs> Second, whenever they say something, I read it with like a higher standard because I'm like, oh, that, that person said something smart once to three months ago. I'll never forget them. <laughs> oh my gosh. You know, it, it, it's, it's impressive. So it's strive to be your best or, or also be really funny. I also like the funny people. <laughs> okay, yeah, let's do. No. No problem, Freshy. In that case, enjoy your stay. But I'll be needing to collect your interment fee first, of course. Wait, what? I just walked by, and he wants to ask me for a fee. Why is bacon called bacon and cookies called cookies when you cook bacon and bake cookies? Cookies. I think you just ruined my life. I hate this. Stop it. Mods ban Terma. My life is ruined now. <laughs> Would you ever interview Larry in a YouTube video? Would you guys like that? I mean... Maybe... I would love to, you know, but 
the reason why I never did anything like this, I'm, I'm just kind of shy to ask, you know? But I would love to, to do that. I would really love to. Maybe I'll try asking. I, I'll try to build up the courage. I'll think about it. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah. Well, and, and then there was Christmas, right? So... I, I would have a hard time dealing with my excitement, you know? But maybe that's what's gonna make it fun. Having two exciting people talking is always more fun than people just being like, Oh yeah, but yeah, yeah, you created that game. I, I kind of heard about it, you know? Um, uh, lots of gamers are playing it, so... I, I guess it's cool. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, so, I feel like it would make things more interesting. <laughs> yeah, I, I, I think... I think that would be fun to do. You know what? I actually... I actually wanted to... Maybe invite somebody from Larian to play with me at some point. But I, I, it's something that always crossed my mind, but... but I'm always too shy to ask. <laughs> it's weird. I think I feel like I just need to get out of my comfort zone, and 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 sky, and ask. The cynic cane. Do I look like I cry all night and shit my pants? Is that why you're calling me babe? I'm not your babe. I'm not your honey. I'm not your darling. I'm a random woman on the internet. And please have some fucking respect. Anyways, um. Uh, Let's play a hand. Chuff to you, Chief. Here are your cards. You're up first. Yeah, we played with Gaming Gar. We did. You glance at your hand. Two purple monarchs. A hard hand to beat. But here's the thing, Zenery. I find that... Uh, I find that... I... I... I never refuse when somebody asks me for something. But I hardly ever go out of my way to ask people. And maybe I should go out of my way to ask people so I could put myself in the situations that I want to be. Rather than just trembling to them by chance and luck. <laughs> if that makes sense. Um, I don't know how to play this. Uh, I will fold. Two purple more. Wait, that's good. That's a good hand, right? I'll play my hand. Quite the hand, Freshy. Unfortunately, two is less than five, and that's how many purples I've got. I reckon that makes me the winner. I'll be having your fee then. No dice. I've seen that trick before. Just my bit of fun, Sharpie. I'm sure the Red Soldier. Fine, please, fine, no please, one gets fine, along please, without fine, paying please. the internment fee. So, let's Abby, make this. Thank empty. you so much. Thank you so empty much for your subscription. I made the bunnies with you. Thank you. Thank you, Tree. You guys wanna be nice? Ha! Huh, I'm not known for paying my way. Well, Thank you so much for the support. Thank you. What's my favorite Dragon Age game? Can I be honest with you? I love all Dragon Age games. Even the second one. Even though I really hate how disrespectful the second one is when it comes to reusing assets. I felt that same disrespect playing Elden Ring. I know that's not often that people compare Elden Ring with Dragon Age 2. But Elden Ring, at times, when I fought a boss that I have seen 500 times in the game, I felt as insulted as when I played Dragon Age and I ran entered in a random basement and it was the copy-pasted basement that I just entered five minutes before. But that's just me! I'm not saying Elden Ring was a bad game, but I'm just saying it has its flaws that nobody talks about them. Uh, anyways. <laughs> um. 
Do you really want to shake down one of the lone wolves? Lone wolf, eh? If you lot are as fearsome as they say, how'd you let a troop of goons like the Reds get their hands on you? Again, it's a good game. But I think... I think Elden Ring would have been a much better game if they just cut out the copy-pasted shit that they put in that game. Cut out the repetitive bosses, make the world smaller, condense that content into what is actually good. The same thing could be said for Dragon Age Inquisition, and most games that, that were released around 2010. Anyways. Ralvo looks you up and down. You know what? I'm in a good mood. Take a hike, Freshy. You wouldn't have lasted the night in my pack. <laughs> you hear that, mates? This cub's got claws. I sh I Let's have try them out, shall we? Hold on. Panic. We should be fine, right? They're just random uh, naughty dudes. They are way past your prime. Hold on, this is a rogue, right? How about we put them really far? So they don't come back, stab us. Yep. You see, he burned himself. Hold on. Can I? Jesus. I think it's not worth thinking it. This is fine. He just drank water. Nice. Oh. That's okay. Well, we can kill this guy. Wow, we can easily kill that guy. So we'll make sure... I think maybe Sabil might be able to kill everybody. Okay, because now... She can throw a dagger... And kill this woman. And then she can... Oh, I, if I didn't have teleported, she would have killed this guy too. Oh well. Next turn. Next turn. My minion can probably kill him. <laughs> hey, Epic Dwellers, how are you doing? You you can grow plants in this game and touch game, them? Really? I don't remember that. This is Divinity 2. Divinity? There is no Divinity 3. This is the very beginning of the game. Easy. Bye bye. Okay. So we'll just loot this random shit we find. Wait, I should loot with uh, Red Prince. Ooh, a grenade. Hold on. I will need the, the bad road. Abar, yes, uh, open world games, they, they... I thought I really liked open world games until I played some bad ones. Open world games, you need to know what you're doing. I, I don't know. I, I personally find uh, that uh, more condensed games with things that are worth seeing, especially because time is our most limited currency, right? Yeah, that is to everything, I guess. But time is our most limited thing, so I... Stay back. What's Stay that back. game that was released? Uh, I think it was released when last year. Will source change back? They had a bunch of What's zombies. The game... Look, the, the final boss, the credits bugged, and it was almost like nobody wanted to take credit for that game. Enti, thank you. Thank you so much for your support. Thank you. Gollum? No. Dying light you. Dying light you. 
I've seen... Some people brag that that game takes you 250 hours to complete. I sadly played that game beginning to end, and I wish I didn't. Because I don't remember anything about it except that I was very bored, frustrated, and complaining all the time. That's the memory I have of the... Thankfully, not 250 hours I spent playing that. Maybe it's better to play with your friends, but as a single-player experience, I hated it. Because it was... The entire game was walk from point A to point B, kill zombie, walk to point A to point B, kill zombie, point A to point B, collect random crap, point A to point B, kill zombie. You, you do that for over 250 hours? I Is hate this that! Harder than BG3? This oh, this one. Why I didn't try BG3 yet. Yeah, this way, this game is so much harder than Baldur's Gate 3. Yep. This game kicked me in the ass so I could be a superstar in Baldur's Gate 3. Tides in and out and in again. So, I don't think it's the quantity of the content you want in a game. It's the quality of a content. Why is Baldur's Gate 3 so exceptional? Why is Divinity so exceptional? Because there is no... There is no... How do I say this? There is no... Content for you to just waste time. Everything that's there is good. There is no fluke. No, no, no... You know... No filler. Yes, filler. That's the word. There's no filler. Yes. So, if you go to a random basement, you're gonna find something cool in a random basement. That's why you can't go there in the first place. If you're walking the beach, you find a cute oh, dog. Hey! hey. I thought you might be Emmy. It's... It's nice to see you. Okay. Do we tell him? About Emmy? Okay, so this dog gave us a quest that he was really sad because Emmy, his, his mate, was taken away. So, they basically tortured his mate, transformed her into a brain-dead dog that's a murderous... That's a murderous beast. Starfield is also a great example of that. Can I be honest with you? I would love AI-generated content if it was used as a tool to help creative people make their work faster. But it could never... It should never be used... Why am I in combat? It should never be used as the finished product. A map created by an, an AI, that's an unfinished product. Uh, an AI creating the canvas, so somebody goes and makes it good and interesting, go for it. Hold on. I, I, I just need to really quickly kill this guy, I guess. Hold on. Oh no, there's a dog. Oh, I hate killing dogs. Oh, this is bad. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Should I stop talking with Buddy? Yeah, let me take my leave just so Buddy doesn't get accidentally in combat. Uh, let me... Let me walk here. Shit. I will waste 180. I think it's worth it. And then we'll bleed. So we get the Istra AP. And then we'll get Istra action. And then we're gonna backstab repeatedly on the back of this woman. And then we'll backstab her. Nice. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Oops. 
This is fine. Divinity Original Sin 2 is much harder than Baldur's Gate. Much harder. I feel like AI can be used for things, but only, not, not as the finished product. I think AI should be used in the beginning to help create a process that then you add to it and make it... Because the thing about things that are AI created is that they all seem AI created. You know, they 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 all have this this soulless, empty void of nothingness that is just boring. You know what I'm talking about, right? It just seems. It's something without a point. It's something without purpose. It's like the dialogue in Plague Tale. The characters talk, 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 but they say nothing. Sorry. I, I, I feel like I woke up today and I chose blood. Ooh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Matt, thank you so much for the 20 months of support. Thank you. Thank you, thank you. Asgorgian, thank you so much for the two months. Mwah, thank you. Welsh pirate, thank you. I, I need I need my pirate hat. The, soon you're gonna be a pirate in this game. I can't wait until we get to the ship. It, it was one of my favorite parts of this game. Let's knock down this dog. So knock, knocking down is extremely OP in this game because people lose the entire turns. The real VH app, thank you. Mwah. Even some games that are not made with AI, few AI tools. Yep, yeah, exactly. Oh, it's a bit leveled up. That's good. Hold on. Hold on, you guys. I, I'm, I wanted to add Losa back to my party. Will she join me with good XP when I get her before the ship? My opinion about Horizon Zero Down? I think your Horizon Zero Dawn is a game. It accomplishes exactly what you expect from a generic video game to be. It does nothing special. It's extremely mild. It's like if video games had a flavor that would be vanilla, it would be named Horizon Zero Dawn. It just does nothing special. It's boring. I guess the same could be said for Starfield. Oh. Mm. I really think there was a lot of people that love Horizon Zero Dawn. And, and that's okay. You know, one of my best friends, turns out she loves getting popcorn, dipping it on ketchup and eating it. And she's still my best friend. It's okay to like bad things. We all do. We all have the bad things we love, that's fine. <laughs> no, it's okay. It's really okay. Ooh, I mean, that's what makes us interesting, right? That we disagree and that we... Because here's the thing. No, but here's the thing. Okay? Here's the thing. I find that we are better when we are challenged. If you surround yourself with only people that agree with what you say, you will never become better than what you are. You're gonna die in your mediocrity. So, it's good to have people who tell you the things that they don't like about the things you like. So you realize them and you start paying attention and realize first the things that you like and the things that you dislike for the things you like. Like, all my favorite games, I could spend five hours trash talking all of them. Because no, no game is perfect. I have the same hatred for a lot of things, even the things I love. It's not a hate, it's just an observation. It allows you to really understand what you love and what's valuable for you and what's valuable for somebody else. And when you get a bunch of people that can see that and they work together, they can make something that's truly valuable for multiple different people because you have multiple different options. 
And that's the skill you really need when you're making video games. Whew. So, you know, we are gonna... There's things that we both like, and that's great. And there's things that we'll disagree, but that's also great. And that's what makes anything interesting. Uh... I, I wanted to do something. Oh. I don't need to kill those NPCs. You know, fuck this. Here I am. I, I, I'm i feeling are. bad for them, but... Yeah, I know. I literally woke up and chose violence. I think I was taught this. Like... On the... On the year... On the year that uh, Baldur's Gate 2 won Game of the Year, my dad taught that Diablo 2 was going to win Game of the Year because that's what we played a lot that year. I played Diablo 2 is probably one of the games I played the most. So when Baldur's Gate 2 won Game of the Year, my dad actually bought the game and decided to try. He never got into it because it wasn't his thing. He didn't like games with a lot of dialogue. But it I loved it. it. And I couldn't stop playing it, even though I didn't even speak in English. Don't think of the ugly now. And that's Here how I my love for Baldur's Gate and games like this came. Here we are. It started. Yeah, my dad my dad got me into games when I was three years old. That's why I'm like this. Find your face, find your face. So, if my dad wasn't open-minded enough to buy a game that he disagreed winning Game of the Year to, to try, I, I, I wouldn't know one of the things I love the most. It was her, wasn't it? Uh, oh my goodness, oh my goodness, Rollo Dev, thank you so much. Mwah. Thank you, thank you. Yeah, my, my dad is awesome. My dad is great. Hold on, hold on. We need Finesse. And we need... Uh, Warfare. Mm. Or do we do it? No, warfare. And uh, we'll have some teeth. Okay, perfect. The monster. Okay, now we'll do crime. Okay, so th those NPCs, they have a very heartfelt story. <gasps> a bucket! Nice. Nice. Bucket star is squad assemble. We only need one more bu it bucket. Was her, wasn't it? A five. The monster. Hold on. Instead of putting on Fane, I, I should put on Red Prince. Here I am. Here we go. Here you are. We are the bucket Here squad. Okay. Uh why are they wearing buckets? Because it's fun. It's actually bad to wear buckets, but, you know. Um, uh, I'll bleed. And then uh, I will backstab. Okay, so those NPCs, they have a very heartfelt story. That's very sweet. But, they give XP. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. I meant... I, I thought I pressed one. Oh, shit. And I can create this skill. Oh, that was bad. I got the news boots? Okay. Uh, I'll fix them. Let's focus on Mego. I'm literally going full Dark Urge right now. But that's okay. I, I, I need... I need... So this woman has a really good ring that allows me to heal my characters. Wait. No, we attack. And then... Uh, so... The the daughter and the do uh, and the dad, they... They got divided. And then the dad, he kind of like got sucked of all his will to live. So we reunited them. But, you know, they had enough time to bond together and talk. Now I need my XP. I hope you guys understand. Well... That's why there should be consequences for you to doing things like that. Like, I know for a fact that those NPCs, I'll never see them again. 
So do I care? No. I care for the XP. And that's all that matters to me. No, this this game is raw. Yeah, this game is raw. Okay. How about? Now we can also... Look, this is such a good ring! Look at this armor! It's so good! Is Sir Laura okay? Yes, Sir Laura is okay. Uh, it, this is not my first playthrough, but I I, 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 I I played this game five years ago and I know this guy does, does not show up again. That's why I, I guess I can. <laughs> it's okay. Uh, okay, let's talk to... to Buddy. Oh, hey! Hey! I thought you the Emmy. Wait, did they show up later? It's, it's nice to see you. Don't make me feel bad I killed them. God. Okay, don't guys like me. Holy shit. This is Buddy. So, you guys know how there is a dog named Buddy in the circus of Baldur's Gate 3? I think it's a reference to this dog. I met a dog named Emmy, and she's working as a source round now. Source? Hound? Did she. Did she seem happy? Let me tell him. Do we tell him the truth? Sarah, my memory is really bad. Really bad. For certain things. Do we tell the truth? Okay. I'm down with saying the truth. But that's just gonna make him sad. I would just say it's hard to tell. Well, at least she's out there somewhere. Maybe she'll come back someday. The dog wags his tail, hopefully. Oh, hey. Hey! I thought you might be Emmy. It's... It's nice to see you. How about some... Some belly rubs? I think I love you. Okay, that's bad. Reach it to you, Sasha, and hand him a shiny red ball. B -b ball ball The dog squeaks the ball repeatedly, happy as a clam. Yes, the cat did survive. I know. I know. I know. But if you didn't feel some sadness, happiness wouldn't feel as happy. That's the lesson I learned from playing Last of Us. That game traumatized me. Okay. Uh, let's go to the dungeons. Armin? Okay, thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you for your prime. May the bunnies be with you. Thank you. Thank you. So, elves in this game, they have the superpower to eat dead people's body parts. And when they do that, they learn of how they die. Cool. Okay, there is one. There is one problem here, you guys. Um. Will the dogs attack us? They were making some Last of Us multiplayer game that got cancelled. Can I be honest with you? 
Last of Us is good for the story. Not for the gameplay. The gameplay is just... Zombies, you know? Zombies and shit. Okay, can I even carry those paintings? It's too heavy. Oh, but the Red Prince can. Yeah, gameplay is okay. Of course, party song. Wait, hold on. No, I'm only on XP rampage for now. I just wanted to get enough shit so I can sell to this NPC and buy some some spells. If this is all we have, we're done for. Before you stands a figure, her body wreathed in cloth. All you can see of her eyes hold are on. two dark holes in an ornate mask. Yeah, this is this is great. We could talk to her, but or we could loot. Instead, I say we loot. Wait, I looted all that? The birds are asleep. The moon's in the sky. To get no much. The seven watch over us. You're safe in bed. Oh, this is not good. So close your sweet eyes. Rest your are books useful for anything? No, no right? We, we just saw. Oh, you see, I have the store so. Amadia's blessed. Very well. Hold on. We already talked with her. So I can eat that person's store so. A sea voyage. Children and adults huddled together for warmth and comfort. You were a slave to the ancient empire not so long ago. Oh. That's how this person. This is what that person was thinking right as they died. So I guess the ship ran. Before you stands a figure, her body no. wreathed in cloth. What do we want to buy? Eyes are two dark holes in an ornate mask. What is good? The problem is I don't think we can afford. The, this shit is two thousand gold. You guys, this game is impossible. If I kill the the merchants, do I get their loot? Amadia's blessings, very well. So long as Gareth returns, we'll... Asking for a friend? Hello, stranger. Oh, peace of mind is good. Haste. Hold on. You've come from Fort Joy? Oh! Can Sorry. I ask if... Did you happen to meet a man named Gareth on your way here through the swamp? Mm, no. Nope. He, he'll be back, Samadel. I really I woke up into his violence. He has to. Yeah, I have been leveling bartering and stealing. He has okay. to, indeed. We need our leader. And if he doesn't return with help soon, we haven't a hope. Uh, can I help somehow? Like, you give me your scrolls for Sam. free and I can bring him back? You're kind to offer. But you'd best awesome. talk to Gareth Squire. Mr. Dave, Excellent. thank you so much for the two months. He'll thank you. No where your talents can be most used. Hmm. I don't know. Now, Han. Let's take a look at your nasty leg injury. Catch you later, stranger. It, it's good you're here. Wait, if I have Beast in my party, she will remove all my collars now? Oh. Seriously? Are you still with us? Is it worth it? To get beast? Woman shoes her lower lip as she observes the injured before her. She bends oh, to grab a rag, bend? wiping I'll her blood smeared oh, hands. You. She looks up and sees you. Okay. If you're looking for healing, sorcerer, well, thank you. I'll dress There's not much thank I can do. What's your favorite dressing? You really and Shida, thank you so yeah. much for the treatment of support. Oh, with Losa too? Oh, I want Losa in my party. It's just that I, I messed up Losa's build. And uh, I had to tell her to leave. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you guys for being so kind. Mm. I played a pacifist run. I don't think I can play a, fa a pacifist run. I'm a barbarian at heart. Now, 
nothing... Wait... Hold on... We got a healing ring, right? Ooh... Okay... Let... Um... Hold on... Let me just leave... Let me take a, a heal... Uh, a ring... Hold on... Where is Fane? So, I forgot to equip the good stuff we got. It needs to be changed. Uh, this armor is great for the Red Prince. And... We have boots. That gives 8 HP. Perfect. Oh no, we can't. We can use this. Well, I think we all have good armor now. Have fun! That's good. Don't That's progress. Hand, now we can heal this guy. You, you healed me. How did you? Oh, never mind. I don't care how. I only care that today won't be my last. Ah. <laughs> That's the least I could do after what happened to you. I don't remember. I barely had time to realize the Magisters were attacking before I was injured. Nice, the last nice, thing I happy. saw were these things, these shriekers. Shriekers? Those Magisters are gonna pay in blood. Oh yeah, the the weird guys. If my mother were here, she'd box my ears for not but... being able to thank you properly. Though I reckon that walloping from the Reds was punishment enough. Aww. Take this, at least. Oh, <sighs> free thank stuff. You. What he give? You have my I'm thanks. Alive. I'm alive. Okay, now let's heal this this elf. Oh. Mate, is the wound is festering. It needs to be changed. That person is not gonna give me money for healing them. That's better. <sighs> Can I kill them? I kid, I kid, I kid. Where was the lady that sold uh, uh, ranger skills? Do we get Losa back? Please, Armada, bless and protect nah. your humble service. Do you guys think we can handle the fight? Now? Maybe we can. More junk. Hey, Endurance! I'm not sure. Soon. Soon. I think the randomizer is fun every now and then. You know, if it's too much of randomizer, it becomes overbearing. I think uh, some playthroughs like randomizer, they're better in small doses. Oh, wait. We can hear this guy too. One face is better than none, but I grieve for those we lost. You killed us. All of us. I owe you a debt. We all do. Okay. What happened to, him, to you? The Magisters attacked our camp back at the harbor. Forge Joy Kitchen? I caught one of their arrows right in my side. What's that, the Forge Joy Kitchen? That would have been a slow death. I've seen it before. No, no. It was an NPC in this, in this place. Yes, this is the definite edition. He will... Will we be able to join the fight and try to escape this island? He lands a comradely slap on your back. His strength has definitely returned. Don't you doubt it. This old war serpent's still got some fight left in him. Nice. Especially... Nice! How about... Oh, oh! He stopped. Dang it. I read too fast. It's okay. It's okay. Maybe we should fortify this place. Make a stand. Mmm... Yes. It's the sexy lizard, isn't she? The one that sells the things I want? Where's the sexy lizard? Oh, she's here. The Red Prince interrupts as you're about to speak. What? This woman is a dreamer. I can see the answers spinning in her eyes. Do rest your legs for a bit while I question her. Sure. You're too kind. Red Prince and the dreamer exchange courteous pleasantries, as if they're finding themselves in a palace hall instead of a death-ridden swamp. She introduces herself as Bahara, to your surprise, they next lie down on the ground in a seemingly warm embrace and fall asleep. So lizards just sleep with anybody, literally. What follows, though, is far from peaceful. 
They claw and thrash as if struggling for dear life, caught in the hold of some hideous nightmare. What the hell? Then they wake, haggard, yeah, yeah, yeah. exhausted. Yeah. They speak of a vision, Brahmos, and another red lizard. Ooh, Bam, Bam, thank you so much for the three months of support. Mwah, may the bunnies be with you. And Shida, thank you so much again. Mwah, thank you. Are you all right? <laughs> Praise the daylight. I am now. There was death in that dream, chasing me like a hundred hungry lions. Wow. But at least I've new directions. When we escape and find ourselves on the mainland once more, I must search for Brahmos the Wanderer. Okay. Then I will finally know the truth, the very secret of my soul. Okay, we got his quest. I guess we gotta do that. Oh, right. I want to find your face. Find your face. One wagon, thank you so much for your prime. You were fortunate oh, to have you. found this place. The hollow marshes swallow yep. life and regurgitate only the dead. This game is really good. Okay. Um, I want her stuff. Tactical retreat. I don't have money. I could buy this. Is this good? I think this is good. Hmm. Oh, those are all good. Do crime. Which is better, ricochet or barrage? Ricochet, because it takes less AP. You could sell this. Oh. Oh. Oh, panic. Oh, panic. I don't know if this is worth Hi, it. Luke. Happy to be here again. Love hey, your streams. Hey, Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you for the two months. Oof. But if I unlock this on iPhone, it's bad because I want to have Losa in my party later. So I guess I should save the money. Oh, panic. Oh, panic. I'm so poor. Frankie, I, I, it's awful. I, I had to kill NPCs I like for XP and money. And I like them. I just didn't have another choice. I pour. A little push off the edge is how it takes. I know. Azoka, I'm not sure when I will be where. I really, I don't know. But I will be back at some point. Okay. Hopefully we are able to do that fight. Sh should I go and get Losa now? Jesus. Yeah, I'm not sure. Oh, if I have an idea, I'll let you guys know. Okay. So, in the beginning of the stream, we tried to do a fight here, but I just getting I just kept getting wrecked. Hopefully, it will go a bit better this time. Hold on. Your eyes brim with inquiry, so ask. No, no, no. I, I didn't. Can we stop? Hold on. Maybe we can just get Fane. He's Nick. Oh, he's Nick. Okay, okay, we sneak. Can we all just sneak to high ground? Hold on. I love sneaking in this game. 
Don't mind the don't mind the rocks, okay? Don't mind the rocks. Okay. Now we unzing. Oh my goodness, we're in combat. Exactly. Okay, now that guy's invisible. Okay, you see this guy? We have to fuck him up. I'll create this turret. I will put him on. He will move away, anyways, right? Oh, but the blood guy is just so much better. How can I get some blood? I guess I'll just need to wait until the next turn. Okay, I'll just save my AP. He jump. It's okay, he has low ground. That's so that's less damage. Okay. Four AP to get to this guy. Or I could spend one AP here. And then do this. Okay, good. Okay. Okay. Yeah, but Sibyl didn't act yet. I need more initiative on Sibyl. She has she acts too too late. Okay, we have the high ground. So we can literally just shoot that guy. Oh, oh, I could have shot twice. Okay, we encourage it, everybody? Oh no. <laughs> oh no, Sibyl is crippled? She can still teleport, right? Yeah, she can. Because now we can uh, bleed and we can use the action surge and then we stab and then we stab and then we stab high five and then level up perfect Sarah mwah, thank you so much for continuing the gifts that you got from full leg yeah I know I don't need to kill the sad guys only the real one but but they give XP. Okay, hold on. Uh If I create my minion on frozen blood, is is it going to have a blood infusion or an ice infusion? Do you guys know? Does anyone know? I'm mousing over the surface, it's not telling me. Cursed blood or something? Yeah, it's blood. Okay, there we go. Okay, good. I wanted blood. Okay. And now, this guy can fuck off. Let's send him on that guy. He's just too close to us. Hold on. Oh, the cursed one is the real one, right? Sabil cannot go to this guy. Maybe she can actually. Seven Sun! Ooh, thank you so much for the five months. So, right now, so enemies in Divinity, they have magical and physical armor. So, right now, this guy has 185 physical armor. And I'm trying to think of the best way to strip him down because I can only reach his health. If I strip his armor. Let me fortify Sibyl. This is fine. This is okay. I can slow those two down. So they can do less. And then I can shoot that guy to help strip his armor. 
Okay. Hey, hey! Hey, Leo, thank you! Arthur's night tail. I don't think so. Oh my gosh! Random Alice can do. Thank you so much for the two months. You're awesome. And thank you, Leo. I, I don't think I ever played these games. I played the King Arthur game that was released recently. Hold on. Let me make my minions stronger. And I love that game. But I forgot the name of that game. Thank you. This is in the very beginning of the game. Where are you still in the very beginning of the game? Okay, let's put a turret here. Okay. My, my turrets, like... Oh. They kind of shoot randomly, but that's okay. Can't let the iPhone die. Oh, boy. Ivan got stunned because he was standing in blood and the blood got electrocuted. I really need to kill this guy. I actually should have killed this guy first. Invaders, attack. Oh my goodness! Adrian, thank you! I, I played King Arthur Knight's Tale. So I did play that game. Oh, that's the one they were... So I did, Leo. Yeah, I did play. I didn't remember the name of the game, but I really liked that game. Yo, Adrian, thank you so much for the raid. I hope you had a good stream. I'm kind of getting fucked in the ass right now. By this fight. But hopefully, things are going to be less dire soon. I don't think I can reach behind him. Oh, this is really bad. Yeah. So, I cannot crit. Well, well, well. That's okay. I would need to heal Iphan. I don't think I can, though. I don't think I can. Oh my gosh, Pettis, thank you so much for the two months. Uh, I will. I think I'll definitely play Dragon's Dogma too. A any cool games that come out, we'll definitely try them. The only problem is that there is no cool games coming out right now. So we're gonna stick to probably Baldur's Gate and um, and Divinity. Balasca, thank, thank you so much for gifting your Adrian a subscription. That's so kind of you. Mwah, thank you. Thank you. You're. Oh, really? Oh, thank you, Adrian. That's so kind of you. Thank you. Mwah, welcome to the stream. Um, uh, one ugly puppy. One ugly puppy? There is somebody called Unclean Puppy that stops by this room. I feel like you guys would be best friends. At least you're clean, my friend. I would rather hang out with somebody that's ugly but clean than somebody that's unclean. Thank you. Your support goes directly to blackjack and hookers for my bunny. I appreciate it. I really do. Um, how's our health? They're okay. So, it's random damage, so it's okay. Okay, we're we're most removing the armor of the true boy. Okay, everyone is blinded. This is fine. This is fine. Okay, we need to kill this guy since he's almost dead. Can I move? I can't. I'm blocked. So I just need to pass. Panic. Okay. This guy, we can knock him down so he doesn't take a turn anymore. And hopefully, we can kill him. For the XP. Oh no. Everything is out of sight. And I can't move. Shit. What do I do? Do I panic? Fain ruined this for everybody. 
Okay, we need to kill this guy. Did I get backstabbed, Red Prince? Ah! Can I start over, you guys? Oh, I fucked this up so fucked. No, no, no. Fuck. I thought I was clicking this guy. Oh, no, he's gonna die. I don't have money to... To, to resurrect people! It's okay. It's okay. As long as he doesn't die, we're okay. Okay, this is fine. We need to move Fane so, so he allows other people to move. Okay. Nice. That guy killed. No! Ay, 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 ay. Oh, this is so bad. Oh, this is so bad. Oh, I can't believe this. Oh, no. He got knocked down at the frozen blood. Oh, please don't get knocked down. Oh, is he blinded or something? Oh my god. Oh, this is so bad. This is so bad, you guys. This is so bad. Red Prince will be missing on the XP, right? If more than one character dies, it's awful. You know what? I should bring... Yeah. I think I can do better. It's okay. Uh, Barrowmancy? Barrowmancy in this game is like the most OP thing. No. Wait! Wait, this is in the middle of the fight. Okay, this is good. It was before I killed my own character. Hold on. This is when I didn't know if I could create on blood or not. Okay, so we'll move Fane. Oh, we can't. You know what? I'll just create this, this guy here. The blood guy. I'll make him stronger. Okay. And this guy that's by my side, he goes. He goes here. Okay. Now, does anyone need healing? No. Wait. I could use heal to damage this guy, right? No, I should save for my characters. Because I only have one healing. Okay. Here we go. This is fine. Oh, Sabil? So can she backstab somebody? I think she can. Hold on, hold on. Oh, the backstab line is where the red prince is. That's okay. That's okay. Hold on. I might be able to just hit him. Oh, man. And I hit him again? Ah, he still has armor. So I just put armor on the skill. <laughs> I'll dress him. Oh, thank you so much for the gift subs. Thank you. Okay, so this is good. He blinded? Okay, he blinded Ifan. So Ifan is absolutely worthless right now. Can I use can I make my arrows be bloody? Nice. How long will blinded last? Bar Conky, thank you so much for the four months. Mwah, may the bunnies go with you. Yeah, I know I can press so. Oh no. Oh no, we are wet. Oh, he will stun all of us. No! 
Oh, he shocked the iPhone. High five. Perfect. Because the iPhone is kind of useless right now. He swapped the Red Prince with Fane. That's really bad. He just swapped my characters around. Like he owns the place. Oh no. Yeah, the AI in this game is obnoxiously smart. It's awful. I think I should just... Uh, I should just break this guy's armor. Fast as possible. Oh no. Oh, this is bad. Oh, this is so bad. Because I wanted to knock that guy down, but now I can't because he armored up. How is this possible? The NPCs are so smart. I should have done that and then the other one. iPhone is absolutely worthless. But he's taking a lot of hits, so let's just keep him alive. Danny here, thanks so much for the four months. Mwah, may the bunnies be with you. Okay. This is absolutely fine. For some reason, the AI is going for Red Prince. Can I do anything? Danny dear, thank you so much for the four months. Gosh. I can't let the prince die. If Red Prince dies, we are we are bonied. Not in a good way. And I can't move because if I move. Okay, this is okay. We got the free attack. Ow. Oh, and he got a hundred shield back? Okay, Red Prince is stunned. This is awful. This is awful. This game is too hard. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Okay. We need to kill this guy. No, hold on. Yeah, I need to kill this guy. Before he gets... He finds a way to get himself some shield. Okay, this is good. Oh... It's okay, at least he killed Ifan. He was useless the entire fight. This is fine. This is okay. I think I should resurrect Ifan. Oh my god. I don't know if this was a good idea. But let's pray. Nice! High five! One dead. Nice. No. Okay, this is fine. Okay, we'll use this strong attack. Okay. Now we just attack. It's okay. This is good. Because now, Red Prince can... Oh, he can knock down anybody. Shit. I need to hit this guy. This is the boss. 
Hold on. So, Bill. I need to walk. This is fine. Then we will action surge. And we stab. Okay, good. And then we attack. Okay, good. And then I fun. Prepare yourself. I don't think I have. I should have just shot the guy twice instead of inspiring. Hold on. I can probably just shoot him. Yeah, it's fine. He just teleported to build to in front of him? And he stabbed her. I forgot to get the blood arrows. Shit! Hold on. You know what I can do? I should probably teleport this guy here. No, but the Red Prince is here. Do you guys think I should teleport Sibyl back? Probably. Because then she can kill this guy. In her turn. No, they all drop good XP. I'll put this blood turret here. The only problem is that I can't heal anyone and the iPhone is likely going to die. You know what I would do? The problem is that I'm undead, I get healed by poison. But I'm very close to a guy that get, that's also undead. Did I miss? Okay, let's drink this poison bottle of beer. No, it's fine. It's fine. Oh, it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Yeah, we killed this guy. Okay. And we can also attack the boss. Okay, okay, nobody... Nobody died. Yet. Hold on. Hold on, I can't let Fane die. So, I need to throw my shield. Hold on. Shit. He's too far. Hold on. Hold on. I'll fortify Fane. Shit, this is hell. This is... this is hell. I can't backstab the boss. Okay. I'll need to teleport the boss down, so I have the high ground. Okay. At least he doesn't have armor anymore. You'll see what's real when it stabs you with the eye. Kill the real one. 
Because I think if I kill him, the other ones die and I get the Easter XP. So, I will actually put him... I'll put him where all my characters can reach him. Like here. I'll need to move away from his back so Sibyl can backstab him. Okay. I'll need to knock him down. Okay. And then I'll just shoot up. Because I, I can't walk. Because if I walk, I'll block... ...the place where Sibyl can teleport behind him. And backstab. Oh, she still doesn't have space. That's okay. I'll just bleed. I don't think I can walk there. I can. Nice! 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 Hold on. Hold on. This is fine. The only problem is that the iPhone is dead. Will he get any experience? Oh no, Sabil is charmed? I can heal him. Isn't he undead? Hold on. Is he undead? Yes. Okay, so I can heal him. He takes damage from that. Okay. Do my totem hit Sibyl or him? Oh no, my, it was a poison turret! He healed... Oh my god, they're also trying to heal him with poison! Oh, this is awful. This is awful. Okay. It's okay. Oh my gosh, he's at 6 HP! I need to ram him. Hiring target is blocked! I won! And we got max XP! High five! And only I fan died. Which is... Expected. Oh. Do you understand? This game is a lot harder. The the AI in this game is actually intelligent. The NPCs like they combo, they stun you, they take away your best characters, teleport them away. Jesus Christ! As you pick up the ring, you feel a cold, dark pain shoot up through the bones of your arm. Your mind itches. Panica. You don't hear, but feel a whisper in the cavity that functions as your ear. It tells you to slip the ring onto your finger. Wait, the ring? Isn't that suspicious? Sir Laura, 
Can you just move away from the goddamn poison? Oh, you guys, but I found died. I don't have another resurrection scroll. I don't have money to buy one. Oh, I do have money. Okay, I'll actually go resurrect him before I do anything else. Just so he doesn't miss out on the experience. Hold on. Hello again, child. Oh what no, I came you? only with one Go character. In our it's okay. It's okay. It's okay, it's okay. I know, the problem is, I don't I don't have stealing high enough to steal. Hello again, child. What brings you here? Hold on. Can we buy two? For 80. We sell. And we sell. Okay. I think I need to retire. I think I need to retire iPhone from my party. Like, in every fight, he's just fucking dead. Every fight. The last three fights we did. I can't respect him yet because I'm not using the gift box, so I would be using Lose instead of him, but Lose was even worse. <laughs> ay, ay, ay. Hey, Hey, Zanderus, this game is a lot harder than Baldur's Gate. Like, the AI in this game is, is actually really fucking smart. Hey, Elite Fergus, how are you doing? Hey. Yeah, we, we are the Bucket Squad. So... We wear buckets. I know the buckets are bad. I know. I just like them. Yeah, we can get the pirate arf. We can. But but I like Lose more. I know. Fane Fane is my main character. I am Fane. Hey, hey, I'm doing good, I'm doing good. I'm just getting my butt kicked. Like, I started the game by the, the NPC calling me stupid, and then there was a puzzle in the statue that whenever I picked the right answer, the statue was like, ah, it must have been luck because you look pretty stupid. And then I got fucked in the ass in this fight, as you guys saw. And in between that, I had to go and kill the NPCs that I liked. Because I needed some extra XP. And money. Oh my gosh, I forgot to find behind. I played Divinity before. I played it, but it has been five years. So this is kind of like my first playthrough, because I have a really bad memory and I don't. Really I remember like sub. a. Few, it, it's like a first playthrough Why with a glimpse of memory. So much better hanging out here, even uh. when seeing all the games, I could never beat Blue Angel Bucket Gango. Oh hey, Nosomi, thank you. That's so kind of you. Thank you for the five months. Welcome, welcome. Yes, I played the the, the original game as well. I did. Like, if you ask me what I remember of the first game, I basically remember the, the guy that turned into a cat. And I remember some random buildings in a random city. And I also remember a bunny. <laughs> of Divinity 2, I remember Peeper. You know, the, the void chicken? I remember that chicken. I also remember one part that gives me that gives that gave me chills during the Losa part. But I don't remember why it gave me chills. I just remember I really loved it. <laughs> well, to be fair, I'm playing the game on tactician. And on tactician in the, in this game it's hell. So, 
if it's your first time playing this game, maybe don't play on Tactician. But but I kind of wanted to get railed. Okay, so iPhone will get bartering. Uh, we'll get uh, warfare on him. And we will get... Uh... Do we get him some constitution? We should. Because he just doesn't stay alive. Okay. Now let's use our camp. How do I identify items? Oh! Like that? This is a dagger. Oh wow, it does a lot more damage. Than the ones we got. Ah, oh, that's kind of sad, isn't it? Nine, eleven, eleven, twelve. And air damage. But it gives one strength and one warfare. What do you guys think? Do we swap this? Hi. Hi. I have no reason to show you my evil face. I miss this music cheer. Uh, Avec, I think I already picked that chest. Grease is actually good in this game. Yeah, I strength and warfare are too good. Yeah, I'm using baskets as my helmets. Okay, let's keep going in this dungeon. It can't get worse, right? It just can't. <laughs> Famous last words. I'm doing good, I'm doing good. <gasps> That's plenty. The pain was all worth it. What? Lucky find. Oh my god. Good find. Nice. Oh my god! <gasps> nice! Look at that one! Oh it my god! No, no, no. Oh, it, 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 the armor gives warfare? It's been cursed. No, it's cursed. Ah! What do I do? We always burn. Oh my! Panic! Fuck! Guys, for some reason, I thought this was Baldur's Gate 2. And you cannot... On Baldur's Gate 2, when you equip a cursed item, you cannot unequip it. Grease? Grease? So I blow everyone up? Kenzie Ray, thank you. Thank you so much for your subscription. Thank you. Jesus. Maybe we should give this to Ifan, actually. So he's last trash. Oh my gosh. You're so cool. Kenzie, thank you. You're so sweet. Mwah. Thank you. Fuck. How do I... Wait, Gratiana Sojar? Wait, isn't that... 
Isn't that the name of the lady? That's an un undead that I was trying to... Ooh... If I suck at this in my weapon, can I remove it later? Made it all this way. This game is playing with my feelings. <sighs> oh, yeah, well. Why were you so intent on keeping me out? He trembles and seems to shudder with a quiet sob. I'm cursed, you know. Bloody Bracchus bound me here to protect his vault. He has my soul in that jar just there. And I can't leave without it. As long as the jar stays unbroken, I can never truly die. I say we help. I say we help. I feel bad for him. We help? We help. I mean, don't no help this fucker. If you are alone. Okay, so this guy, when we enter this dungeon, the first thing he asked me was to see my penis. And then I fell into a trap that it was a really hard fight. And when I finished the fight, he summoned a chest that had nothing inside. The moment I clicked on the chest, he started calling me stupid and saying that that was too easy to fool me, that I was a fucking idiot. And that's, that's where I ended my stream and, and you guys saw the rest. But I still feel bad for him. I say we help. He's not an asshole. He has been cursed and imprisoned here for God knows how long. Why didn't you try to make fun of any idiot that enters a cave? I mean, if I was bored, trapped in a cave, if an idiot entered, I would have probably done the same. No, he was cursed by a guy named Raxus Rax, and that guy's bad. Okay, I'll help break your... I will, do, I will help break your soldier. Wait, can I ask? What did you do to earn s such a punishment? I don't rightly know. This was the Source King's way. Befriend you, then destroy you. I was a fool to expect I'd be an exception. Do I also play Baldur's Gate 3? Sometimes. Every now and then? Nah, nah. You know, you know what? How about this, Shamanian? Tomorrow, I will start my first Baldur's Gate 3 playthrough. His favor was... intoxic. Be here tomorrow. That's no excuse, but it is the reason. Hmm. His favor was intoxicating. So he basically sucked his dick for power? Yeah. We'll help him. Really? You... You would? He drops to his knees before you and grabs onto your feet with both hands, head hanging. Thank you. High five! Hell yeah! Helmet is good, isn't it? 
Oh, but then we'll lose the buckets. My first solo owner mode 1 HP randomizer ever wrote this advantage run. Valerian, how did you know the next challenge run I was gonna do? <laughs> Kill me. Uh... Shit. Valerian, sorry. What is best? I like the gloves and I like this. Finesse and scanner, isn't this perfect for Sibyl? Can she use this? I think she can, right? Valerian. Can I pick more than one? Can I steal the, the choose your hill word? Oh my gosh, we get telekinesis? Holy shit. Okay, so Sibyl is losing her bucket. But Fane can gain a bucket. High five! Um, now, who gets this pants? Oh, Red Prince. Red Prince is gonna get some pants. I guess Sibyl is gonna get some pants. And... Uh, this is a bell? Wow. Yeah, Red Prince is great with a bucket. What else did we get here? Where's the curse shit? Heart of the Tyrant? Brand of Bracus. Sad Cursed. Okay, so... What the, What happens when I equip this ring? I'm really tempted. It's bad. Can't take it off. Oh, but I'm so... Okay, I saved. The ring just got tighter. A lot tighter. W what happens? Oh, fuck. That's the ring that... <gasps> Holy fuck. Holy fuck. No, no. Oh, you can remove in the next room? Right? Good for a challenge run. Gosh. No, it's okay. We can just reload. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Fain is too heavy. You know what? Fine. I will re-equip it and I'll tighter. go to the next room. A lot tighter. Easy. Okay. Hold on. What else did we pick up? Hold on. Wait, what? Target gets damage bonus equal to the percentage of their missing vitality. That's cool. If I put a rune in my weapon, Sibyl's weapon can fit a rune. Can I can I remove it later? do this I need to combine with this what? how 
do I do this? Came for BG3, stayed for your kind and fun personality. Oh my gosh! Your entertaining gameplay and the cute bunny Lua love. Oh, thank you, thank you. Oh, thank you. Thank you so much, Feladia. Thank you, that's so kind of you. Look, this is a cute bunny. He's leaving. Oh, you sleep? You sleep. Ah, oh, he's such a good boy. Oh my god. Oh my god. There's a lot of shit in my inventory. Can I select everything? And... No, I can't. Oof. This is fine. This is completely fine. Thank you so much, Valadea. Thank you. Hi, hi, Duke. How are you doing? No, no, the game is breaking me. I love it. I love it. Renzi. Kenzie, okay. right? Thank you so much for the five sub gifts. All your support goes directly to Blackjack and Hookers for Boo. Thank you. Yeah, Red Prince is my mole. Because he he also has my bartering, so he 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 needs to sell everything for me. Okay. Okay, let's get out of here. You say there is a next room. Oh, go. Oh, nice. What's this? Lava. What's this? The deity's head and hands are missing, severed as if by a sword. You can't tell if this was meant to be symbolic say, somehow you. or a mere act of vandalism. Okay. Hmm, what's strange about this statue? As you take in its chiseled details, you have a vision. The statue comes to life and embraces you awkwardly with its broken arms. Unable to resist, you're flown away into an endless dark. That shrine seems to have brought me here. What is this place? Marcus, oh my gosh! I remember this place! I've seen it once! What's this? Amaja. You walk towards the figure on the dais, but wisps of mist start to cloud your vision. With each step, the mist gets thicker, hiding the figure from sight. You guys, I love having a bad memory. I know that I love this game. I forgot everything about it. But whenever I get to a place like this, I remember seeing it before, but I don't remember anything about it. It's. Does anyone else have the same problem? It's a blessing and a curse, but it's great. You walk towards the figure. On the dales, but okay. Pain. Have fun. Pain. Oh, that voice is very familiar. You push through the fog, chasing the voice at breakneck speed. You trip and start to fall, but catch yourself against a bookcase. I know, Evelyn. It's like that for me. Usually, any game I play, if I wait two years, I forget. There's a very few things that I will remember, but, but, but it's like maybe I remember things out of context and things are missing. I do have ADHD, so it could be because of that as well as Muzu does. You look around in shock as the mist clears. You are standing in a library. Your library. You hear a cough behind you and turn to see your assistant, Harina. She hands you a thick book, Observations on the Universal Veil. You look at her in confusion as she explains, You asked me to bring you your research, Master Fane, for your guest. As you walk through the library, Harina expresses her condolences. It is a shame that the King forbade further investigation into the Veil. It was a fascinating topic. 
She leads you to a door, your study, and pushes it open to introduce your visitor. You step through the door and see the Lady Amadia, one of the Seven Lords. No, I didn't go bark at the dog today. I, I, I'll need to go tomorrow before you stream. I was already late today to stream. I say tree, you guys. Because I feel like we... We're... We're kind of like weird. I, I don't know. This is weird. What do you guys say? Or maybe you could aim deep, deeper. Let's do two. Turn to Harina and ask this woman what this woman is doing here. Okay, fine. Bow deeply and welcome Matron oh, to your humble office. You. Fine. So oh, please. There is no need for ceremony or dusty titles. I'll dress. Oh, you may you. address me as Amadia. I must say, you created quite a stir earlier, dear Fane. The other lords and I were quite impressed with your research. We believe the King's decree that you should not investigate the veil was misguided. We would like to view more of your research. And I see you have already brought me some reading material. Kindly give it here, my boy. This, uh, I think this is the past. So we got teleported into a room. We are in our library and we have a research. Okay, let's hand her my research. She thanks you with a smile and thumbs through the pages, engrossed by your work. Yes. Yes, quite fascinating. A barrier of pure source. Do you truly think this veil is the key to unlocking a new future? Of course, Sir Major. The veil is the single greatest discovery in history. It seems to hide unimaginable power. Or maybe two. The king thinks it's dangerous. He says if a veil has been created to hold something back, perhaps there is a reason for it. Yes, so we gathered. But Fane would have said one. We found it strange that the king would refuse you the chance to explore something that could be so beneficial to our people. Hmm. But perhaps there are still paths we can walk. Perhaps. There is a crash of timber behind you, and you can feel hands grabbing you. You are dragged backwards as Amadia screams. What? The screams fade to nothing, as does the scene before you. You're standing on the cold, glowing stones once more, with Lady Amadia before you. Fane, darling Fane. I had to know. I had to be sure. If you were not who you claimed, it could have been a disaster. Okay, so this woman is the woman that I was harassing in the, in the end of the last stream. So last stream there was a woman that she was an undead. And Fane, he is part of a race of people that had an empire and a civilization. But everyone he knew and everything he knew was gone when he woke up in the beginning of the game. And that woman, she was also like me. But she wouldn't say anything to me. Oh, is that Gratiana? Me am I mixing Gratiana with a major? I think I am. I'm just fix mixing the NPCs. Yeah, but I harassed that woman thinking it was one of them. I don't know. I find her voices to be the same. A disaster? Who did you think I, I was? Who? Anyone, my child. Anyone could be. Oh, a she worships this woman. Oh. No one in this world has escaped the madness unleashed by the king. Oh. Madness? What madness? We know why the king forbade your research. Why? He already knew about the veil, Fane. He was draining its power, leeching from it to build up his own strength. When we confronted him about this betrayal, he used his power to try and subdue us, to turn us to slaves. The king wanted to slave his own people? That doesn't make sense. 
He wasn't satisfied with our fealty. He wanted total control. His madness for power knew no limits. We fought, of course. The king scorched our land, but by uniting, we overcame his evil. He was banished beyond the veil he had tried to subvert, I saw but it. our victory was hollow. Our people, oh my child, they were erased, destroyed utterly. We seven were all that remained. My people? Gone? It can't be. I fear that it is. But you must steel yourself. The fight is not yet done. For centuries, the King has been searching for a way back into our world. And beyond the Veil, he found the force that could help him do it. The Void. The moment we discovered the Void, we understood the Veil was created to hold it at bay by powers even more ancient than us. But thanks to the King, that evil has been seeping through the cracks. We have contained both ever since, but now, alas, they are winning. Uh, if you're in between Baldur's Gate 3 and Divinity, play Baldur's Gate 3 first. Because Baldur's Gate 3 is a lot easier to get into, and if you, by the end of Baldur's Gate 3, you want more, then you get Divinity. But you, you have a lot of hours you spend in Baldur's Gate. But how? What, what, what changed? I fear we are no longer united. I fear... well... The gods are no longer united? Amadia turns and gestures to the scene behind her. Down below, you can see the six other gods fighting, clawing at each other, everyone desperately trying to get the upper hand. Over the centuries, the drip of void into this world corrupted the others while they played with their mortal races. I fear it is too late for them. For us. But you, Fane, you have been untouched by it all. The world needs a power to protect it, and you are the key, Fane. But you have fallen so far. I haven't felt whole for many, many centuries. You will feel whole once again, child. You have my word. I will guide you, but first you must return to the world and escape that island. But you will return more powerful, as your first step towards righting the wrongs of this world. I grant nice. you my blessing and give you the ability to bless in turn. Oh, nice! She bless! Amadia stretches her hand out, and you feel a warm glow spread through your bones. You feel a sensation that you have not felt in a very, very long time. Oh, goodness. You may have noticed I have tried to help you on your journey. That I can bless the very water beneath your feet. Now you have that power oh, for yourself. And this is only so it was her who saved us in the ship. More and greater powers await you. If only you will seek them. And seek them you must. But before you begin, a word of warning. I gather that you travel with a pack of these lesser creatures. Yes, sadly. I, I do travel with a lizard, a human, and an elf, you know? It is only natural after so long spent alone, but you must be wary. Some of these creatures are more dangerous than they seem. They are Godwoken, the chosen champions of the other six gods. Okay. And then there is the one you know as Losa. She is something else, something wicked. You must beware of her above all others. I need to invite her to my party. For they will all walk the same path as you, but they cannot be allowed to reach its end. You must be the one. Only one of our people can wield this power. Only you, Fane. Okay, so... I assume if you're playing this as any other character, you're told the same thing. She lays her hand on your skull, and you see it clearly. 
the others, the gods, Amaria, and you. You are her chosen. You are her godwoken. Okay. So go forth into the world with my blessing, dear one. Heed my words and go. Blessed branches we've returned. Every second we spent in that hellish place was a second the great acorn drew closer. Oh my goodness. Interesting. You thought it was interesting, Quercus. Do you know what's interesting? Watching an entire world be strangled by the roots of doom. Seeing the giant races fall like leaves in frost. Hearing the screams of... Oh, the great acorn. I don't know what you're talking about. I am perfectly calm. Anyway, as interesting as that cold hellscape might have been, it does not solve our problem. We are here to stop the great acorn, not hide from it. Shit. Okay, so hold on. Saving the world is no small task, Sir Lower. How can I help? It's already helping more than it knows, Quercus. The fate of the world depends on our ability to research a spell to protect Rivalon. We need to travel across the land, gathering clues, experimenting with different magics, and come up with a spell to shield Rivalon from its doom. Okay. Of course, for us to do that, we must avoid I will being stop the great eaten by the servants of the Great Acorn. And that is where our big foolhardy shield comes in. Okay. Excellent. You have enough to worry then let him care of the grand nut. Okay, this is definitely a coming joke. And none of us saw it coming. <gasps> Punks, defend. Bloodbear, how are you doing? How was... How how was your stream? Thank you for the raid. Thank you. You saw it because it came on your face. I can do more than just kill Void Woken for you, Sir Laura. <laughs> Quackers. Because it thinks it can use magic at our level. I don't know if that's adorable or just sad. Come on, Sir Lower. How no, dare you? I am not going to share our magic with it. I don't care how much you like it, Quercus. I... Very well. I cannot give it magic, but I can teach it how to forge one spell if it will keep you oh? happy. The squirrel reaches out touching your foot with a delicate paw and you feel your mind open. Bah! You can see the forces of magic and see how to combine them in a new way. Awesome! There, maybe now your pet will have a fighting chance. Yes, yes, you're welcome. But can we please get on and save the world now? Let's go! <laughs> Blood bear, what were you playing? Welcome, welcome. Okay, okay, so can we blast? Oh, but we don't have source. Is there source anywhere here? Well, shit. How do I get source? Yeah, so so it's a skeleton squirrel riding. No, it's, it's a skeleton cat riding a cat. That's Sir Laura, and Kirkus. See you in go. Hey, I love it. I, I love him. What's up with people like you that attack anything that they see? What's your problem? Don't you ever think? Well, you know, maybe this is an interesting character. I'll get you know later. And who would kill a cute squirrel? No, so in this universe, 
you can be a skeleton as well. So you, your character can be undead. When you start the game, you can either be a human lizard or an undead lizard. His cat just turns out to be an undead cat. It's just that the, the rules are different for undead. For, for undead, for example, healing spells damage them. And if you, you need to drink uh, uh, poison potions. Wait, where was the... The source? Is it inside this cave? Okay. Sub. Yeah, 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 yeah. D don't tell me spoilers because I, I, even though I played this game before, I, I forgot everything about it. I, I really do not remember. And I also never played it from Fane's perspective. So true. Thank you so much for your tier three sub for three months. Mwah. It's so kind of you. Thank you. All the blackjack and hookers. For, for, for. For boo. Oh, you guys, look at him. Look at him. Oh, he's so fluffy. He's so fluffy. Oh. Okay, so... Instead of working together against the king, the... the... Um, the gods are now getting their champions to become more powerful. He's not wide. He's fluffy. Like He's very fluffy. The agonies of an era and beyond. <laughs> oh shit! I think I can blast him. Wait. Ah! Okay. Okay, wait. There is oil, though. How, how do I remove oil? Can I remove oil with water? I don't have the rain spell. Hold on. Shit, is there any waypoint nearby? Oh my gosh, we need rain. Okay, we need to come back here. Because I'm afraid that I will walk there and those pigs are gonna blow up and that's gonna make me really sad. Hold on. Hello again, child. They don't die? Are you sure? It's okay, we'll go back. We'll go back. Oh, let's let's get her the jar that we found. She stops dead as you pull the jar out of your backpack. Her voice trembles as she speaks. You entered the vault. You please give that to me. Give it to me now. You're very keen to get your hands in this jar. Why this jar has her name on it? It matters not. All that matters is that you give it to me. I think one. I think we just give it to her. She reaches greedily for the jar, tearing the cap off. You see a green glowing light emerge from the jar, enveloping Gratiana. By Armadia, I feel... I feel... wet. Oh, Goddess, I can feel your tears upon my face. What happened? I... 
I suppose you deserve to know. Before I knew Armadia's grace, I was a very different person. I was the concubine of Bracchus Rex. What's a concubine? Is somebody that fucks somebody else? Okay. But more than his lover, I was his partner. I discovered his power to feed on the source of others, and I allowed it to... No, I made it happen. Why would you do... such a thing? You don't understand. No one understands. My heart held such fear. But with Bracchus, I was safe. He needed me, and I needed him. Oh boy. As his strength grew, so too did mine. There is nothing you cannot do when you sit on the lap of a powerful king. And I did it all. But power changes a man as he changes his nation. Bracchus grew paranoid, angry, murderous. I don't know what to do. Should we just stand in silence? <laughs> I don't think I would judge, you know? I gave him more and more, trying to win him back to me. I offered him the source of whole villages. He oh devoured them and demanded more. Oh my gosh. The lands outside were once green and beautiful until I came. Until I turned them over to him. Now all's poison and the dead are restless. Well, whatever crimes you committed in the past, it's just, you seem to be trying to make up for them now. Armadia is merciful in her love. I found this shrine while hunting a band of wizards. I found the goddess weeping for her children. And I wept too. I'm glad you found your way. She pauses for a moment. Better late than if never, she had eyes, right? You're sure she'd be wiping them. Aww. Through Armadia, I saw my sins, and I could bear it no longer. I threw myself from the cliff at the entrance. I tried to rid the world of my evil, but Bracchus would not allow it. I don't know, you guys. I feel like the entire point of life is to become a better version of yourself. And if you realize that whatever else you were before, it was bad, and you are trying whatever you can do to better it, why not give these people a chance? Because if you're never merciful, then nobody has a reason to strive to be better. And Eva will just keep going and going and going. He brought me back from the Hall of Echoes, locked my soul away, and demanded my obedience. Even in death, he commanded me. How did you escape? Only when two source hunters ended his curse was I freed. Since then, I have returned to and spent centuries trying to heal the pain I've caused. And now... Of course. Merciful, not naive. So it must be when people are truly willing to be better, right? And not... And not just make face, you know? Sometimes there is some... How is that saying goes? The... The dog that bark doesn't bite it also goes the other way right sometimes a lot of people scream by how good they are but they actually aren't should value people on what they actually do not what they say they do she drops the now empty soul jar to the ground smashing it to pieces with her foot But we are seeing that she is, she created this place to help the people that are getting hurt. 
So she's definitely actually trying to be better. You have my thanks, brother. Because we can see the results of her actions. She's not just saying it. And I feel like everyone becomes a more interesting person when they have their own redemption arc. Thank you for your tell. And I'm happy that you're trying to live a good life. She starts to speak, but chokes back a sob instead. Thank you. I don't... I can't... I've never known such kindness. Thank you for everything. May you walk forever in Armadia's grace. High five! Hello again, child. What brings you here? Gareth. Please come oh. back. That's so sweet. Oh, I love this. I love this. Okay, okay. Wow. And I actually have some money now. The birds are asleep. The moon's in the sky. Hold on. Uh, is there anything we must buy here? So close your sweet eyes. Oh, this is good. Oh, this is real. But it takes all my money? I already have the gloves of teleport, but I can't so I can't afford it. Echoes of death. Yeah. Hold on, I should buy with iPhone. The birds are asleep. The moon's in the sky. I don't think I can afford anything. I'm scared to spend money. So close your sweet eyes and rest your wee head. You really jump. Oh, my penny. Three months already? And Luality love your brand of crazy, and you're a heck of a gamer. Thanks for the consistent stream in Luala. Oh my gosh, Ozzy Lovesley, thank you. I have been streaming for seven years, and I'll be around as long as you guys have me. Thank you so much for your support, for Blackjack and Hookers for my bunny, and your kind words. I'll keep trying my best. Smoke and thank screams. You. Thank you so much. Echoes of death. It's thanks to, you know, your support no. that I can do what I love most. Please so thank you. Go in our Mardius grace, you. child. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, let's try to Are we wet here? Maybe oh yeah, we're wet. Look. Maybe if we're wet we can it's been cursed. What? Ah, ha! Cursed. Please, Armadi, bless and protect your humble servant. Let's go! Let's go! It worked! Hold on. Uh, let me... Do we have pets? No. Pen. Hold on. Amidst the placid little pond, the face of a goddess lies half submerged in the water. Rivulets stream from her deep set eyes like endless cascades of sunlit tears. You feel peaceful in her presence, soothed somehow by an intangible comfort. Does the ranger lady start to actually be able to hit a shot? Her percentage out of the gate are below 40%. Truth bombs... I, I think... Does anyone... Can anyone respond to truth bombs for me? I did play Divinity Original Sin 1, but I played it five years ago. I don't remember anything. But I'm sure things get better. They always do. Ah, oh, thank you, animals. Thank you. Hugs, thank you. Oh, I, I appreciate you being here. I, I, I do. So, so, Hoffmeister, 
I played this game five years ago and I really loved it. And when I played it, I played it multiple times. But it has been five years and a lot has happened. So I forgot. So it's like I'm going through something that I know that I love, but I get to experience it all over again. So it's great. You're intrigued to notice. This is another statue of a major, very like the one you saw in the dungeons. As you gaze upon her loving face, you find yourself drawn into a trance-like state. Does anyone know? Does anyone remember anything of Divinity Original Sin Shu? Franco, you usually never forget anything. A voice seems to reach you from within your mind and from the furthest reaches of the stars. He's cursed. Its whispers caress you like a breeze. Ah. We listen. The voice grows stronger, like a breeze picking up. What were whispers become words. My children, my children. Gone are my children. Dead are they in the cradle I have ruled. I'm sorry. A feeling of indescribable sadness assails you. It feels like your heart merges with the spirits, torn together by a coil of thorns. Sub. High five. High five! I'm sorry, it's just a sad moment, so this was the saddest high five. Zainz, thank you so much for the two months. My child, my child, weep with me for the mother who has lost. Weep with me and bathe in the tears of Amadia. Without a word, in absolute privacy, allow the ache of her pain to fear your bones. The eternals are gone. You have both lost your people. You feel the goddess's presence surround you. Feel her nestle you tenderly like a mother. Reach you out really to lay your hand Sub. against the carved stone. The Lady Amaja, whom trusted above all others. Fain, fain, fain the brave, fain the savior. I think I'm the main character of this game. Kravetsky, thank you so, so much for the four months of support. I really appreciate it. The intensity of thank her embrace deepens. Never since the unremembered days of childhood have you been so enveloped in maternal safety. My child, my child, I love you. My own, my own, I will guard you. Wander where you will and cherish the kiss of Amadia. You feel yourself shine with an inner light, rejuvenated and pure, as if born anew. Awesome. I'm actually blessed. Wait. But it only works with Fane, right? Thank you, Kravisky. I really appreciate it. Four months of blackjack and hookers for my bunny. Thank you. You guys, earlier I was just tearing up. And protect your humble self. If you just screams. I just will fix the codes of death. He's come back. We'll find Gareth next. So the NPCs here stop crying and leave us alone. Rich Divinity game finished. Hold on. Oh, this is so cool. River Chain. I, I, this is not my first time playing this game, but. The only thing I remembered for this game was that I loved it. And the chicken named Peeper. Gosh. I love all these games you're talking about. I love Dragon Age. I love Mass Effect. I love I love Divinity. I love Baldur's Gate. I love I, I love these vibes, you know? It, it's a vibe of game that I feel like if you love one of them and you played all of them, you love them all. Hold on. Where can we go for Garab? Leia? Here be pigs. Zalaskar.
Honestly, I love Peeper. Peeper, we are gonna meet Peeper when we get to Act 2. Wait, what's this? You guys, I... Here's how my memory works, you know? I remember that there was a fight here. And if I remember that there was a fight here, it was probably hell. Because it was five years ago. <laughs> Should we try to uncurse the flame... Uh, the red prince? Hold on. Before coming here, because... To be fair, every fight is a, is really hard, and... Right now... Right now... Hold on. There was some source near the pigs. Let's go near the pigs. Wait, this is not the pigs. Oh, it's here. Hold on. Let's get that source photo. Oh my god. Okay. This is fine. This is okay. Okay. Now we can bless. Bloody ring. High five. It's loose. Nice. Get off me and stay off. Okay, cool. Can we uncurse the ring? Shit. I don't know. I don't know how long. So, I want to get Gareth. In which direction should I go? Should we go to that maze? I d I'm sure if it exists, it has a use, right? So, I, I would definitely save it. Oh, I love Disco Elysium. Guys, I played Disco Elysium when I was in one of the lowest points of my life, I was really, really sad and depressed. And that game just kept me going. I would love to replay that game when I'm not feeling so miserable. Maybe we should replay it soon, TM. Should be a quest marker. Journal. I don't think it is. Find Gareth. I don't think it's a quest mark. I must say this. I was in a very low point of my life when I played this Elysium. And I think that... Uh, after seeing the game... I decided... To look for a therapist because I didn't want to get as bad as the main character of this realism. Does that make sense? <laughs> so it was exactly what I needed when I needed. <laughs> Zalat's fired and down the hill. Thank you, thank you. We go. Okay, so Zalek's fire. Wait, this is also a fire. Hold on. Do we go through the pigs? Oh, I don't want to deal with the pigs. They're squeeing a lot. We are in the beginning of the game, Apollo. We are still in Act 1. 
We are basically a little bit after the tutorial. Can I save the pigs? We'll come back for the pigs. So let's go do this fast for uh, this quest first. Hold on, I'm going the opposite way I want to go. How am I? Okay, hold on. We want to go this way. North. We north. Okay, but this is to the pigs. We north uh, this way. Yes. Okay, this is where we got the chest and explosions. This is where we escaped of uh, Fort Joy. So, it should be this way. Chris Menace, uh, the, the writer of Disco Elysium, he wrote a book. You hear a dry ah! cackle from the platform above. Turning, you see a rickety corpse staring down at you. So the writer of Disco Elysium, he wrote a book, but the book didn't go anywhere. So he sold everything he had, even his car, so he could make the game. New bones clattering around the mire. Our master will be pleased. Uh, I'm not looking for trouble. I'm just a traveler passing through a swamp. So few look for trouble, and yet so many stumble across it. But do not think your lying tongue can save you. So you are lie. no simple traveler. I can see the gods' mark upon you. Yeah, and the... my master has bid me return your kind to your gods. Panic. I think she's about to fuck me in the ass. Like most things in this game. Yep, it's happening. You really jump. Invalid target? Misunderstood Conqueror! Mwah, thank you so much for the two months of support! Thank you! Oh yeah, this game is a lot harder than Baldur's Gate. How do you mean invalid target? Hold on. I, I need to... Oh, she fortified. I need to create a new field. Okay. I will teleport Sibyl behind her. And uh, I'll create my minion on this blood. And we should be good. So, uh, I'm using a summoner. Depending on the kind of surfaces that I create my minions. It's low ground. I think I should still do it. To help remove her armor so Sibyl can just literally fuck her in the ass. And then we attack this guy. Nice. Oh no. It's okay. We're standing behind so it doesn't matter. We'll do a blood sacrifice. And then... I am... Here we go. I mean I can't attack. I'll not take a no for an answer, lady. Show yourself. Holy shit. Okay. Um the guy went invisible. We can probably fortify pain. I'm ready. 
And I guess cry? I don't think we can do anything. I don't think we can do anything else. Yeah, Fane is my character. I, I can't move. This is awful. Okay. Uh, let's create... Can I move? Worth it. I'll just make my minions stronger. Reveal yourself. I mean, he did. Did you get what you asked for, Ifan? Hope you're happy. Nice. Okay. Just pass. I think I'll deal with this guy. Nice. And then we go up. Okay. Now we can knock him down. And attack. Nice. I guess we just shoot. Okay. Easy. Oh. I can't let Sabil die. We heal. And uh, we create a blood turret there. And we pass. Here we go. Uh, Sabil? Oh my god. Can I not walk? Oh, this is bad. I don't... <laughs> I cannot walk behind him? Oh, this is so bad. Panic. Oh, well. It's fine. It's fine. It's okay. You can just kill this guy. Kill. Nice. Can we shield? No. Can I even hit him? No. Not from here. Maybe from here. Yes. How about? Okay, it wasn't that bad. Much better. I really miss Jump. Yes. You know... Imagine if they made this game. Or sequel to this game or something like this. But with the technology that they got for Baldur's Gate. Oh! Nice. Let's give this to Prince. I love finding items in this game. They're so good. I know, Shovel becomes jacked. I know. Um. Ah! Oh gosh, that was my minion? Okay, so Divinity is definitely the more complex game. I find that the overall, the combat of Divinity is better than the combat of Baldur's Gate. But everything else of Baldur's Gate is better. Does that make sense? Overall, the combat of Divinity wins, but Baldur's Gate 3, everything else wins. This is just a god? The serenity in the eyes of the granite statue seem to infuse the air around the shrine. Oh. This place feels like a refuge from all Yeah, harm. the combat is better. A place where fortune favors the fleeing. 
Uh, so the main reason why the uh, the combat is better in Divinity it's because the combat in Baldur's Gate is an adaptation of a tabletop game to a video game, and in Divinity the combat was made to be a video game. So you you can do a bunch of cool things in Divinity, like very the early in the in game. What feels like forever. You feel safe. You know this is the statue's gift. You know the feeling will not last, but you are grateful nonetheless. I'll close my eyes and I'll get the statue's gift. You feel the statue smile. You feel it embrace you. You fall into the most comfortable darkness. Awesome. Cool. Uh, so... So, very early in the game, uh, Divinity gives the player tools that you can manipulate the combat arena. You can teleport enemies around. You can... You can get the battlefield in positions it's more or less in a way playing chess you you puzzle your combat pieces together and the enemies can also do that and the, the ai in this game is obnoxiously smart like the if the ai sees that they can knock you down the ai will try to line and knock down as many characters as they can like we had a fight that the ai did moves that players wouldn't do <laughs> you know Unexperienced players wouldn't do. Yes, it's basically chess where you can teleport the pieces around. It's cool. Wait, there's a guy here. As you near the figure clad in old blackened armor, Sibyl takes your hand and gives it a squeeze. And yes, Baldur's Gate 3, the, uh, so the combat in Divinity, you can do things like that are fun from the start. In Baldur's Gate 3, you start to have this kind of fun at level 5. Uh, no, Amelia Tyler, she, she's a character in this game. If, if I play more and talk less, we'll get to meet her tonight. Okay, just l let's continue with the game. I actually love her character in this game. And in fact, I her character is one of my favorite characters in this game. Even though I don't remember anything about her, except that she's like half a demon. And, uh, and I was just so happy that she was the narrator of Baldur's Gate 3. And by the way, since I'm the topic of Familia, I actually played Dungeons & Dragons with Familia Tyler last year. She's amazing. I love her. I love that woman. I have a feeling yonder creepy crawly is the lone wolf I've been looking for. You wouldn't mind if I asked him a few pertinent questions, would you? Oh no, he's gonna die. The last people Sibyl asked to talk to, they died. Okay. I, I expect him to be in talk worthy state after you're done. I'll do my very, very best. Okay. Sibyl addresses the solitary figure. You hear but whispers and hisses in return. Just when you think a fight is about to break out, Sibyl's words seem to sway him into submission. Okay. He speaks uncomfortably. She listens, her face hard and pale. His name, you overhear her insist. Roost, he croaks. And with that, the interview's over. Cock? Come, let's go. I have what I came for. Are you okay? I found out who abducted me, who delivered me to the master. I'm going to find the man who did that, and we're going to get mightily reacquainted. She's gonna make his insides outside. For sure. The hooded man exudes a restrained menace that near matches your own. As he raises his head, the hood falls back, revealing the gleaming bone visage of an undead. Oh, hi, buddy. Ah. <sighs> One of my own kind. Be not frightened of me, brother. There's far He's worse kinda. than my bite in this quagmire. Though I see you hidey hiding behind a mask. Are you ashamed of who you are? I am proud of who I am, though it takes some effort in the current moral climate. He laughs. A <laughs> dark and crackling sound that seems to make the ground vibrate underneath you. Around here, <laughs> you'll be lucky to last a day, regardless of your personal feelings. Applicator, did you play Divinity on Tactician mode? I don't think so. Because I think it's the consensus that Divinity is... A oh, Divinity Original Sin 1? 
Oh, okay. Yeah, no, this is the Vinity Original Sin Shoe. Am I tagged as the right game? Then maybe I can help you out. If you have the coin. Trinkets and wonders I have here in my pack. The smallest of costs, I'll tell you. Barely a trifle. If I had eyes, they would have lit up. Do you have artifacts from the ancients? Oh yes, that I do. Some older than even this isle upon which we stand. Okay. Trinkets from ancient humans. Relics from fossilized dwarves and what have you. <laughs> okay, uh, what do you exactly have? I only stock the best baubles, the choicest curios. Take precious wares, are they not? Can I kill him to steal his shit? Plus four initiative? What the? <gasps> Whoa, we need this! right fucking now no 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 we we will make money hold on hold on um i don't need this shit wait who, who has the highest barter is iphone okay so Hold on. Okay, hold on. No, no, it's iPhone. It's iPhone. Uh, hold on. I think we can make money. Hold on. I only stock precious wares. Are they not? Okay. Hold on. Let me. Let me give everything I own to iPhone. So he sells it. We'll sell this shit. We'll sell this shit. We'll sell this shit. We'll sell this shit. Wait, what is this? Okay, so for some reason, look, the bartering of Red Prince is three, but iPhone is five. iPhone is just like. A god of bartering. Keep the one. Yes, I'll keep the one. I remember that being useful. We'll sell this. We'll sell this. Hold on. Shell. Yeah, yeah. Mug. Okay. This is trash. I don't care. I don't care what it is. We need that weapon right now. Oh god. That seems so good. No. No. We need to focus our efforts. This empty. I need to go to Fane so we can... Hold on. Let's combine those em empty potions with this barrel, so we make some uh, potions, healing potions for Fane. Okay. No, I, I don't think I, I can steal. I can only steal once from every NPC, right? I'm not interested. Okay, let's let's what? do this. You expect me to be cutting Maxo's own staff around? Um, ask him how he survived out here without masking himself. Zalaskar chuckles unpleasantly. <laughs> For those with a strong enough. Yeah, will, I'll take the the first. There is always a way. Okay. 
Men in clothes. I was hoping for something more mm, eternal. He stares at you silently for a long moment, then gathers his cloak tighter around himself. I'm sure I don't know what you're talking about. Not even a little bit. He's lying. Okay, let's let the iPhone talk with him. I think he has a story with him. The hooded man exudes a restrained menace that near matches your own. We need to As he raises his head, over. the hood falls back, revealing the gleaming bone visage of an undead. Be not frightened of me, delicate fleshed one. There's far worse than my bite in this quagmire. Perhaps I can even offer some aid, if you've the coin. Do you desire trinkets from the ancients? For the smallest of costs, I'll tell what you. What the hell? Barely a trifle. Who are you? With a horrific rasp of bone scraping against bone, he bows low before you. Call me Zalasgar. Now what else concerning me is yours to ask. My business is my own, and none of it yours. Shit. Yeah, I must have not progressed his quest. Hold on. Hold on. We can... Sell, 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 sell. Sell this. Sell, 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 sell. Everything. It's all going to go. It's all gone. And gun. And the pearls. And... Oh, wait, not the shovel. Wait. Give me this axe. So, who said I can't buy it? Lazu, thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Awesome. Hold on. Let's give that to the Red Prince. Okay. The Red Prince is the strongest character now, by far. Now he gives it to Fane. Let's give him the Purge. Wanda. Okay. Oh yeah, I have a lizard. Yeah, I don't need the... Um, I don't need uh, the shovel. Uh, let me see. Where's my... Where's my quest log? Last one! Mwah. Thank you for the three months of support! Thank you! Yeah, I fun. Oh yeah, we should probably talk with I fun. The air out here is a damn sight better than in Fort Joy, eh? What's this little errand you mentioned? Hold on. If Anne smiles and sit. Hold on, hold on. had a letter in his inventory. I think I sold it. When I was in really need of money. Maybe he can tell me about it. The air out here is a damn sight better what than... What is this little air in off his backpack and reaches into its depths. After rummaging around, he holds out a tattered page to you, upon which you can see a broken wax seal in the shape of a wolf's paw. Nice. Have a read of my contract and find out. That's not yours! What? I think I just... Okay, I sold the letter to the guy. And when Iphon took the letter from his inventory, it's like he stole Very from him. Sub. Very bun stream. Ah, you're back. Looking to ads? I only stock the precious wares, are they not? Bang so, your face, bang your face, bang your face, bang your face. 
<laughs> Martel, thank you so much. I'm happy that you're having a very bun stream. Let's make it even more bun. How do we make this stream more bun? With a bun. Thank you, thank you, Mark. Thank you for the two months. Thank you, Lana, for the raid. How is your stream? So good to see you, girl. And Scoot, thank you so much for your subscription. 43 months, and thank you, Baltatron. Thank you, thank you. Hold on, where is the letter? Here. Wait, I need to kill the divine Bishop Alexander, the divine? Oh, fuck! Ah, you've read my contract. <laughs> what does that look in your eye mean? Blue alert. Wait. I, hold on. Hold on, I didn't read everything of the letter. Fuck. I should have read. Sinvali, thank you for the 60 months! Wait, that's... That's like five years! Thank you. I really appreciate your support. Hi! Lana, what were you playing? Thank you! Okay, hold on. This is impossible. We're killing Alexander! He raises an eyebrow and folds his arms, appraising you. Me, not you. It's my contract. Sorry, iPhone. But you can come along for the ride. Okay, it's not easy, but I'll help. Good to know. And likewise, with whatever errands Thank of your you, own Sinvel. you have. Thank you, Sinvel. Thank you so much for the five years of support. We, I feel like we have come such a long way since five years. And I'm, I'm happy you are here with me. Thank you. Mwah. Thank you. Desert Raven, thank you so much for the 20 months. High five. Mwah. Thank you, guys. You guys are so kind. Thank you. Hold on. Your target is known all other than Alexander, the leader of the Divine Order. Get close and show your benefactor why the Silver Claw is the most feared amongst the wolves. For some aid with your mission, seek Magister's Boris Ghetto. You speak out our motto to identify yourself. Oh, let's go. Okay, hold on. We have a catchphrase with this guy. Ah, you're back. Looking to add some weight to your rucksack? Wait, I don't have the, the, the note. With a horrific rock. Call me Zalasgar. Now tells concerning me is yours to ask. My business is my own, and none of it Wait, what? You look like a one to know already. The source in you. Okay, hold on. Like you we need to talk with Magister Boris. Hold on. Magister Boris. Where the hell is Boris? Is he in Fort Jai? Desert Raven, thank you so much. Mwah. Yes, I know. I love this game. I just forgot everything about it. Hold on. Th does anyone know where that Magister is? Uh, I only Fane lost his collar. But where is he? Oh, I found him. Oh, I found him. He's right here. I think this is the boy. It's okay. This is fine. Boris and then a red prince. Okay. And then an iPhone. And then Los. Uh, Sabil is. Hold on. I can't do anything, really. I don't have a field. I don't want to waste my minion. Should be fine. Graze? Yeah, I'm sure Graze will help me. Okay, so... This is fine. Um... We can... Maybe walk here. Maybe walk here. Hmm. 
Okay, I guess I'll walk all the way. Why am I so far in the fight? They have the high ground. Hold on. Oh shit! I forgot the dog! Oh my god! I'm sorry, you guys. I, 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 I usually don't kill animals. Hold on. So the thought of killing a dog is just like... Just doesn't cross my mind. Hold on. But we'll fix this. Okay. How's that? Yeah, we'll use Grease. Did we just hit for 49? Wow, he hates Siphon. But it's okay, because now we can get our little minion on the blood. Yeah, I know. I... I... I just can't be mad at the dog, you know? The dog was just trained to do that job. Okay. So, we can just go and kill that guy next. I think the red prince will be fine. Maybe that's wishful thinking. Why did my turret not hit anybody? Wait, she didn't walk? Okay, Red Prince is kinda getting fucked. We can't walk, but I don't think we need to walk to to wreck people. I mean, Path is interrupted. He's right in front of me. Maybe that's the problem? Oh shit, no. I mean, Path is interrupted. Stupid. It's okay. Got some blood arrows. Hold on. Nice. Okay, Fane, he can heal the prince. And uh, we can also... You know what? I think it's my turn is more valuable if I walk here. Oh, shit. And uh, get this guy down here. So he doesn't have the high ground when he's shooting us. Hold on. I'm worried about the prince. It's okay. What's obscene? Fine. This is fine. Okay, this guy's dead. And then I guess I can just... Uh... I think I'll walk to this one, uh, so they... So they have somebody else to bully. Not only the Red Prince. Okay.
We we'll walk here. Let's remove the shield of this guy. Okay. Because now we can knock those shoe down. Nice. And we kill. Gosh, the red princess is strong! Okay, cool. Now we shoot that guy. And we shoot. Nice. Okay, now things are under control. Uh, I'd say it's definitely, definitely Divinity is the harder game. You can also shields up. Yeah, on Tactician, Divinity is much harder. Much, much harder. Oh. Oh. Uh, no, I'm not using any mods. My game is raw. Okay, we backstab this person. Oh, I can't. I can't kill this. Oh, I can. Nice. And we can just finish this guy. Okay. Can the prince make sure him? Oh, he can. Oh, he can. I'm sure he can. Nice. Okay, perfect. I should have put the executioner. But then I should loot everybody with iPhone. Ha! Just outside for joy, there is a trader, Zalaskar. Okay. Now we should be able to talk with Zalaskar. There we go. Yeah, I love Rogue. I I love uh, I think I love all the classes I'm playing right now, actually. Oh, we got some pants! Well, we actually really need pants. Don't we? Wait. Plus one retribution. Well, Sibylla has our best pants. I guess we'll go for Fane. Okay, perfect. I agree, pants are for losers, but turns out I'm a loser. Looking up behind you. Let me do the talking here. This one's expecting me. Wait, Ryan, you say that this fight was going to be a wipe? Come on, Ryan. I'm not that bad at video games, ah. Huh? Have some fight, Ryan. Hi Senti, how are you doing? Yes, yeah, Seville is pog. Uh, go ahead, the Ifan. The man exudes an aura of restrained menace. As he raises his head to speak to Ifan, the hood falls back, revealing the gleaming bone visage of an undead. They you want this again, by the cave, Roger? Thank you again, Desert Raven. Okay. Suddenly, the undead's bony claw pulls an elaborate crossbow from seeming thin air. Oh. It appears to be enveloped in misty shade. He proffers it to Ifan, along with a single rank-smelling arrow. Before you know it, the crossbow and arrow are tucked away in Ifan's backpack. And the conversation ends with a curt nod on both sides. Awesome. So, we got to... <gasps> I think that's better than what we have. By a lot. Fog tastico, exactly. Whatever that means. Ifan knocks the crossbow with an arrow. <laughs> he hoists it up to his shoulder. A satisfied smile brightening his face as he stares down Papa. the shadow swirl. Raising an eyebrow, he holds it out for you to try. Care to fire the first arrow from Shadow's eye? Okay, sure. Six shadows eye line up a shot a nearby tree. The arrow soars long and far, whistling a dusky tune as it flies against the breeze. It hits the target dead on, fletchings quivering with the impact. Ifan whistles a matching tune and gives you an admiring hi, glance hi, as hi. he takes back the crossbow. Hi, hi, hi. Knew you had it in you. A good weapon's one thing, but there's nothing on Rivalon like a good companion. Oh. 
The most powerful weapon of all is a man with a friend she strive for. With a smile, he claps you on the back before packing up the crossbow once more. Friends, eh? Well, let's hit the road, friend. I'm sensing we'll need to be good weapons out here. He spins on one heel and begins to stride onwards, keen eyes scouring the environment for any dangers. He turns to wave you along, eyes glittering in the swampy gloom. Oh, you guys, I say that we would kick him off from the party for Losa, but I don't know if I can anymore. Smile. Oh, I can't! What do I do now? <laughs> Peter, thank you. Peter Pan, thank you so much for the two months. There was... Um, the last time I went to Disneyland, I think Peter Pan had a crush on me. He was very, very nice to me. Like, way too nice. <laughs> thank you, Peter Pan. Thank you. Uh, hold on. Also, I I tried to to take photos with Aladdin, and he actually winked at me in front of Jasmine. Can you believe that? The nerve! The nerve! The nerve! Guys. Look at the minimap. That's the scary. The woman traces glyphs in the air, and you cringe, expecting a barrage of ice and fire. Instead, a bit of smoke sputters forth. She cries to the skies in frustration. In <laughs> Peter Pan, I'm rail, sorry. Thin rasp. <laughs> Ah, oh, Parox Donna, I don't know. I, I didn't let the tears fall off my eyes. My lord, I've loved you. I've obeyed you. What's my sin? How long must I suffer? She sees you approach and punches her fist in your direction. Her face flushes red. It's her, the one that destroyed the ship to Fort Joy. You guys remember her? She was in the tutorial. Wait, you're calling me cringe, Aeons? You subscribe to my channel, you type the message, you're wasting your life to call me cringe? You sound like somebody that doesn't know how to have fun or live life. Just get out of here and go have fun. Remove that stick out of your asshole. Oh, the narrator! Oh, okay, 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 sorry. Sorry, sorry, Eons! I'm sorry, sorry! I, I, I thought you were calling me cringe! Oh, Jesus, I'm sorry, dude. It was the NPC! Oh, fuck! <laughs> no, no, uh, it's okay, Eons. I love you too. I feel bad too, dude. I'm sorry. It's just that I usually go off really strongly on people. It, it's, it's because I don't like banning people. I prefer when the, the trash takes itself out. But it's not the case. Sometimes I fire the wrong direction. My bad. <laughs> Thank you. We're all good. The one that stole your mask. She wavers for a moment, and you see a flash of recognition in her pained eyes. <laughs> it was a fine civilian that I accidentally hit. My bad. I'm okay, I'm okay. Uh, you mean seven years online, uh, you know? Sometimes you just... You, you kind of need to be a brute. Yeah. It's the only way you survive it around is here, okay? You, isn't it? You can hide that Hug. skull all you want, but I see you. So, so, here's the thing. The nice people, I'm nice to fold. The mean people, I mean to fold. It's just fair. You're the one who crafted this unholy contraption. Gosh. <laughs> Derby, thank you so much for your prime. Thank you. Most artifacts like this mask are long lost, but you craft them anew. Okay. Who are you? What are you? 
Starfy, thank you so much for your subscription. I'm so sorry. I, 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 you guys, I'm sorry. Hey, 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 at least when I'm rude to an innocent person, at least I have the balls to say sorry. It could be worse. Panic. Sandy, thank you so much for converting your sub to tier one. Thank you. I feel really bad, Aeons. I'm sorry. Ah. <laughs> uh. <laughs> I, I actually feel really bad sometimes sometimes um okay uh i actually reveal people who get banned because i hate when people get unfairly banned and sometimes i get angry and i will say harsh things but you know how after you come to your senses you, you realize that you're wrong. And many times it happened to me that I was in the shoes of the person that was getting wronged. And I never heard and I, I'm sorry later. So it's something that I absolutely hate. So if I ever, if this ever happens, after I calm my tits, I, I try to always make sure that I recognize my, my mistakes because it really sucks to be on the receiving end of an unfair punch thrown at you. It really does. No, no, the streamer is quite often wrong. And if I'm wrong, you guys need to call me out, okay? Don't just shut up and let me do wrong shit. Call me, call me out and, and, and I'll come to my senses. <laughs> okay, my name is Fane. And you stroll this earth before I ratched your spirit. Your wretched species even existed. My, my, what a specimen. It will almost be a shame to destroy such an ancient relic. What? I'm an eternal. You cannot be def I cannot be defeated by some dumb witch. How right you are. Yeah, I... But you face more than Grease, some I'm not wrong. Witch. She turns her head to the heavens once more. I offer this sacrifice to you. Return me to your side. Make me howl. There's a rat nearby. Come between us again. Fuck. Oh, good thing I was in water. Well? How about we put her right here? And then I walk in the water so I stop burning. Yeah, that seems like a good plan. Hold on. Is she undead? No, she's a she's human, right? Okay. Well, uh we can walk behind her. We can bleed. Oh, I can't bleed? Oh, shit. Oh, well. Then I guess we just stab. Okay, we gain more actions. And then we stab more. And more. Hmm, pretty good. Well, let's try your new crossbow, I find. It's pretty good! High five! Who is it? And why? Yes! Okay. So, this helmet, if you if you bought Baldur's Gate 3 on early access, and uh, or if you have the deluxe e e edition, you, you can have it. This helmet in Baldur's Gate allows you to transform yourself into anybody. It's a reference to this game. Yes, I am. <laughs> Okay, okay, okay. By the way, Aeons, you should have seen the people on Twitch. They were really on your side. <laughs> the only thing the mods do in this channel is refuse to make pulls and predictions. Yes. Yeah, Angelicus, I, I, I need you to, to place myself. Hold on, let's... 
I think I can identify with Fane, right? I can't? Oh, I sold my glass to the NPC! Ah, my false faces. Not as fair as my true visage, but better than being seen as a monster. A moment's pause. Oh, sorry. I had thought as too... Well... Guys, I was poor, okay? I sold everything I could sell. You're lucky I didn't accidentally sell you to the NPC. Um, hold on. We can transform into an elf. Oh, look at that. Oh my god, look at his face. Jesus Christ. Yeah, never mind. Fane is so hot. I, I don't get it why I can walk around like this. You were sold to you by my husband for a tuft of booze for? Deal! Where can we make the trade, Lana? <laughs> I actually have a bunch of jars of booze fur. Whenever he's melting, I take I brush him and I save the fur in a jar. Once I had a kidney stone and my mom still keeps my kidney stone in a jar. Maybe I got this habit from her. Maybe. Yeah, where's my bucket? Whatever. I don't know. I don't know. Boost for his precious. More dead magisters. Okay, hold on. Hold on. Hold on. We can put Ifen way. Hold on. We can put Red Prince here. And we can put uh, Sibyl. She can hide. Yeah, but she can actually. There's a dog here? She hide here. Let's talk to the dog. Master, master, wake up! Master, wake up! What happened to your master? Bones, attack bones. Then sorcery. Oh, Lex, I'm Flash. sorry I didn't keep your teeth. She ran. Bones gone. Master, sleep. Wake up soon. I I will not try to change your mind from Fane being the greatest character. Okay, well, your master isn't going to wake up. I don't think I'll tell the dog that. Because if you tell this to Scratch, he attacks you, and then you have to kill him. I miss Lil Sichu. In Brazilian, some older say it keeps ha from happening against you. Wait, Ronya, what do you mean? Uh, Kila Ronin, it's Angora Rabbit. I think Boo is part Angora. I don't know. Okay. Your master isn't going to wake up. I'm sorry. I don't think he will. He's dead. Who's dead? Well, it's when you go to sleep and you don't wake up. Ever. Ever? Ever, ever? The dog is blinded by its muzzle. 
but it turns its face toward you, waiting for your answer. Never, ever. Mm. As she considers your statement, her nostrils start to twitch. She lifts her head and takes a long drag of the air around her. S Sorcerer! You! Um... I am so sorry for what happened to your master. And you aren't... Uh, but I'm... And I'm not here to hurt anyone else. Thank God! High five! Master! Master! Wake up! Never ever... Oh! oh! You're a good boy. No! Go! Oh, Master. no pet. It's okay. It's okay. Okay, no pet. Oh, I feel so bad. Oh, head! Okay, so when you find severed limbs in this game, they're actually consumables. If you eat with your elf... You are floating a few inches above the ground. Your friends are impressed. You bask in their hoots and hollers. Your favorite party trick. And then he died. So elves can eat dead parties of parts of people and know how they died. This is kind of why I want Larian in his next game to be in this universe. Because it's just so cool. Elves go from being the boring, annoying knife ears to actually being kind of bloody and... You see, they heal while they stand in blood. Swifter, oh, thank you so much for the prime. Thank you. They actually become something cool. Here we go. Out. Out. Wait, iPhone is not in fight? Well, let's change. Nice. Nice. We have some blood here. Jeez, this is very far. Prepare yourself. Okay. Darby, I'm not sure if I thank you for your subscription. Oh, thank you so much. Seriously. And and S S Swift Eater. Thank you so much. Mwah. My bunny is also Swift Eater. And and Ubs, thank you so much for the two months of support. Mwah. Thank you so much for supporting Blackjack and Hookers for my bunny. Let's go! Hold on. A full mage playthrough? I actually prefer physical damage. Hold on. Let me take this guy and bring him here. And then... Uh, I think that's kind of overkill. Let me go over here. Oh, I can't attack. Oh, shit. Well? Oh, there's a guy over there. Panic. Red Prince needs some magic armor. Okay. I think I need to... ...to go elsewhere. Because those guys will already die. Hold on. Shit. I go here. Ah, penny. It's okay. We use this. And then we use action surge. I'm ready. Ah, fuck. Then we backstab. And then we stab many times. 
Oh, not bad. I have five, considering how much we had to walk. I know, I know. I like the cannibal elves a lot more. Okay, Red Prince got this guy. And we can also get this guy. Hold well on. Nice. He's taking a nap? Can you guys believe this? This is absurd! Who acts first? This guy. Oh, uh, but we can't kill this guy. Can we? Almost. You see how smart the NPC is? He actually walked to the place where he could cleave most of my... My minions. I find this to be so impressive. I think it's because I find that the NPCs in Baldur's Gate are really stupid. But do you... Do you understand the difference? Don't talk shit about the Gungeons. You can't stop me. Oh, I should have walked behind. I thought it was enough. Well... Not all NPCs are smart, but, you know. So we'll knock this guy down, so he doesn't act. Perfect. And now we just shoot. And shoot. Nice. I feel like finally everyone is strong. Nice. Survivor skills are... are funny. <laughs> cool. I think we're finally getting better at this. I love this game. Yeah! Hey, King Kendo. Yeah, yeah. Turn to me, the one who watches over you. I think Sibyl is God. Why does it keep speaking to me? Wait, it's doing damage to Fane. Those gods are trying to blast the water that I walk on. But those fuckers forget that I'm undead and I get damaged. By this shit. Yeah, I'm I'm trying to find Gareth. Hold on. Hey, Mahalo, thank you! Oh gosh. Thank you so much! I hope you had a good stream. Lana, if you were still around, what were you playing? Sargantus. It's not because of the AI. I feel like you don't like the armor system of Divinity, but. But the pe the 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 enemies they seem to be a lot smarter in Divinity. Oh, Cyberpunk! Nice. How are you liking it? It's one of my favorite games. Oh, Source. Oh, piggies. Wait, is Gareth near the pigs? The ever burning bacon. Hold on. Is near where I fought Wendigo? Oh, okay. Okay. Oh, since we are here. Let me try to heal the piggy. Piggy. I think this is a bad idea. Piggy. Hey, 
Hmm, yes. Panic. The menacing skeletal guardian looks at you wearily, then yawns. So you dare defy the will of Bracus Rex. Prepare to be destroyed, and so on and so forth. Let's get this over with. What? No, wait. It's not like that. I can explain. I swear. Okay, I'm ready. Um. Uh, hold on. Uh. Cal, it's not my first playthrough. I played it five years ago, so it's. But it's basically my first playthrough because I have the memory of a goldfish and I forgot the entire game. So please, no spoilers in chat. I would think that returning to the world would show a, a little bit more enthusiasm. I have enthusiasm for putting you back in the ground so I can return to my rest. I hope this brings the discussion to an end. I don't like being roused from slumber only to be greeted by such banality. Um, have you ever been at the Hall of Echoes? I was raised immediately after my death. I never had the chance to see what wonders await the true dead. Ooh. In a few moments, I dare say you will discover that information firsthand. Okay, well, Bracus Rex is dead. Why do you still do the Source King's bidding? She moans impatiently and taps her bony foot. Yes, yes, I know he's dead. I am still obligated to perform his wishes. He may not live. But the threat of his curse hangs over me. Well, but there is no curse that would know if she would just let me be. You would just leave and return to your nap. Wait, what gives more XP? Is this Mintara? No? No. No. It's Mentor. Oh. It is as you say. In any case, no curse could possibly be worse than this droning drivel. Be on your... The Guardian chokes on her words, as if strangled by an invisible hand. <laughs> well, a five! Easiest fight of my life. Cool. Nice. I feel bad. Kind of. Leadership. I think she has leadership, right? Wait. Yeah, because then she gets huge leadership. And then we can give this to Ifan. Oh, we also need to give her the globes, right? Oh, shit. She's not intelligent enough. Oh, shit. Oh, well. We have some items to identify. Hold on, I'll need more source to help the piggies. Wait, I'm encumbered? Oh my god. Uh, yes, the Kletus. I, I played Divinity Original Sin uh, 1. So, Bracus Rex, he's basically... Careful. Wait, Divinity... I spotted a trap. Is 1,000 years before this? Divinity 1? Oh wow, I didn't know it was that that long. Wait, piggy. Please. Oh, the flames are extinguished. Thank you. That's so cool. 
fuck Oh non Oh non Pec Wow Isn't that so cool High five Yeah it's too dumb to wear gloves It happens to some people Can I suck the source out of something? Like her? Okay, so now we can blast the final pig. Nice. It's actually not the final one. Bob the dog. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you for the prime. Hold on. Hold on. How do we get up there? Up here. Thank you, Bob. How are you doing? Are you an actual dog? I know dog! Woof! 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 Oh! Woof! Woof! The other day I was barking at a dog that was barking at me. At last! The fire is quenched! Nice. Thank you. You're welcome, Piggy. Cool. Oh, he's sneaking. Nice. Shoes. Okay, let's give that to Ifan. I did not mean to insult him in dog. Wait. We need one more source. There is one last pig. <laughs> it's okay, right? It's okay. Don't worry about it. Uh, Fane is damaged by by the the holy fire. Oh shit! I don't think I have source to blast the last one. Do you guys see any source puddles? Oh, when I was a kid. Um, when I was a kid, a friend of my mom had a pig farm and uh, I've heard the piggies crying like this and it made me so sad that I decided to never eat pork and I never did and uh, many years later like 20 years later I I was having a lot of allergies and uh, I decided to do an allergy test. And turns out I was allergic to pork. Funny how that is, right? Wait. We left. Wait. Wait, Piggy. The curse is lifted. Thank you, stranger. Yum. Can I talk to them? They're just running. What the hell? Hey, I'm Sam. Thank you so much for the frame. Hi, hey, wah, wah, wah. Wait. So. We can talk to the pigs? I guess we can loot this shit here. Ale Are you sure about that? Because again, I never even tried to eat pork. Wait, what? Oh, oh good. We can meet it later? Nice, nice. Can't wait to meet the piggies. Okay, I need to find Gera. Let's go there. Uh, I'm also allergic to cats. I'm allergic to dogs. I'm actually allergic to bunnies too. I'm allergic to everything. <laughs> but I have gotten better. I, I had like a treatment with like shots. I had to do some allergy shots every now in a while. <laughs> Kizu, yeah. 
Can you believe? We mod that Baldur's Gate so much. I'm... Uh, I think one of my worst allergies is cats. Wait, what is this red? Oh. He's so tiny. Tiny face, tiny face, tiny face, tiny face. Please talk to me. Can you feel it, human? Five! Slay Soul! Mm, thank you so much for your prime. Thank you for your support. How do you mean? I have always been buff. I mean, I, do, have you seen my abs? I have very cool abs. I'm not, I, I don't have a lot of mass, but I'm strong. Strong. <laughs> I could do a pull up. And for a girl to do a pull up, it takes a lot of exercise. It took me like three months to, to learn how to do one. Oh, yeah. Okay, let's try to feel it. You understand then? Ashes and bone litter the island, but where death comes, life rises. The sweetest scents flourish in the deepest tombs. Uh, tell me, do you like roses? Okay, the animals in this game are really fucking weird, right? I'm actually allergic to flowers. Once we did a plank on stream for six minutes. Can any of you guys do a six minute plank? Um. Well, I adore the fragrant blooms. In that case, you can do eight I minutes. Think you would appreciate the blackest of roses. <laughs> Look deep in the earth to the southeast, where the revolting seeds the rapturous. This. The next time we play together... If I kill you... You're doing an 8 minute plank. So you better start practicing. A dark figure wanders there. <laughs> she understands these roses. Why they take root. Well? well who do you mean? A witch. Allow her to guide you, traveler. Now go. Follow the wind. I never saw rats from mystics. A witch. Wait, is there something in here? This looks very suspicious. Hi sis, how are you doing? I, is... I told you. Let's get the red prince to dig. Quasi psicologo. Thank you. Muito obrigada. Thank you, thank you. Thank you. Ooh. Ooh. Is that good for an iPhone? Isn't that what he uses? Hold on. Yeah. High five! Sis, did you ever play Divinity? This game is a lot harder than Baldur's Gate. I was getting fucked in the ass. And the NPCs were calling me dumb, stupid. As they were doing it. Oh my fuck. Was Bi Baldur's Gate 3 my first CRPG? Timon? I have been playing CRPGs before you were in diapers. My first CRPG, I was 7. Or 9. Around that. I played the original Baldur's Gate, dude. Wait! Oh, the freaking goodies! I hope you are having a divine Saturday. Mango, I actually am! Thank you, dude, for the 10,000 What the heck? It has been divine. I even had the god come and try to suck my dick, but I didn't have a dick because I'm un undead. And boners are actually not made of bones. So it was a frustrating situation for everybody. Thank you, thank you. How are you doing? How was your day? Wait! Can I do this? Oh, 
Hold on. I will need to teleport Ifan up there. And then uh, I would just walk here and pray. Can I even do this? Papa Perkles, no. We'll be playing more Baldur's Gate 3 tomorrow. We'll go back to the 1 HP run or the randomizer. We'll make a vote. Today we'll play Divinity. We'll play both Divinity and Baldur's Gate. Yeah, I'm undead. Sub. Mingo! Dude, thank you so much! Oh, really? Oh, awesome! I, I hope you guys are having a blast! Zombies Lair! Mwah, thank you so much for the You guys, join our Discord server because just as Mango is playing with some Baldur's Gate 3 multiplayer with some people uh, that they match together on my Discord server. I, I always hang out on my Discord server. I have sent over 300,000 messages there. And you can find people that plays this game too. Maybe you guys should call up Baldur's Gate 1, 2, 3, Divinity, you know? If you want a friend for that, you might find one in Discord. We we actually even have a group, uh, 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 a channel in Discord that you can look for group. And you can make a post and maybe you find somebody looking for the game. Thank you, Mango. No, no, third... Uh, uh, yes. 300,000, actually. I, I, I just talk a lot. It has been many years. I'm always hanging out there. And everyone is welcome. I Sub, not sub, just as long as you're being kind, respectful to one another. That's all that matters. Mwah. Hold on. Whenever I see enemies line up like this... I think of a lightning bolt. Yeah, 300,000. Yep. I need to walk into 2 AP. Wait, I can actually knock down this guy? If I didn't miss. It's okay. Is blood arrows good? Hold on. Oh god. Wait, a lot of them don't have... Uh... Oh, I think this woman is a lot more dangerous. So... Maybe we should deal with her. Do I have a knockdown arrow? I do. Okay. Um. So Bill, she can walk here. Yeah, yeah. The, the the people in my server are pretty cool. I love hanging out with them. Hey, hey, hey! Yes, Lusa. Of course I want Hans messages, Luz! Of course! How are you doing? Good to see you! Dresser, thank you so much! Thank you! Uh, Krumbushan, if you... Krumbushan, you can support me, whatever the hell is best for you. Twitch, YouTube, it's all the same to me. And you are welcome everywhere. But, I'll be honest with you guys, I... Uh, if I play a game that's not Baldur's Gate or like Baldur's Gate, it's likely I will be streaming on Twitch. Because that's where most of my 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 audience is for random games. YouTube, I know you guys are mostly only focused on CRPGs. So you should definitely give me a follow on Twitch. Just in case. Because I'm streaming most days. Liz, how are you doing? Do we kill this guy? Can I teleport behind him? I don't think I can. Hold on. I will need to waste one AP. Let's see how far I can go. Because if I can go all the way up over here... 
Oh, that would be so good to kill that lady, but I can't. Okay, I guess we'll go for this one. Jesus Christ. What a disappointment. Let's bleed. Let's take an action. Yes, life... It, Divinity is great. I love this game. I think we can kill this if we get lucky. So close. You better bug me tomorrow, Luz. I love you. Mwah. Wait, a crit on Prince? It's okay. We still have armor. Wait, do we have blood? Wait, there is no blood? There's only blood there. Shit. Maybe if I go up here... I might be able to see it. So, I'm a summoner, and when I summon my minion in blood, it's a lot stronger. That's why I'm always looking for blood. It's not a kink, I swear. Okay, this person is knocked down. So let's try to kill somebody that's actually gonna do something. Who's this person? Now let's kill them. Uh, the, uh, Divinity is Larian's house rule set. Okay, we, we finish this. Ow. I cannot let Sibyl die. Hold on. I think I can go here. Ah, uh, yes. And knock these guys down. Are you serious? Okay. Let's give Sibyl some armor. She's too strong to let die. Yeah, so it's Larian's own rule set. That honestly, I think it's better... ...than 5th edition. Because it's not an adaptation of uh, tabletop into RPG. 5th edition is better if you're playing a tabletop. Hold on. What do we deal with? Maybe this guy. Yeah, we'll definitely deal with this guy. Here we go. Yeah, favorable wind is really good. She's... Healing? Oh no, not my minion. No, what the fuck? If they kill my minion, it's bad. Oh, this is not good. This is not good. Mm. I should have buffed him. Oh, shit. Let's make some blood turrets. <clears throat> Here. Oh, shit. I'll need to heal Sabil. And I'll need to drink a poison. Okay. Nice. Minus one. Ay ay ay. Okay. Hold on. It's very easy to get behind this. So I say we we crit this, and then we crit this. Nice. This is fine. It's less fine now. Okay. Can I have a cleave or something? Shit, I should have killed that. What I can do... Oh, they, they have magic shield. Never mind. Shit. Do I have a healing potion? Yes. 
Oh, I hope Sabil survives. Ah, yeah, yeah, you guys! I'm fucked! Okay, hold on. Who acts? This guy acts? That guy acts? Okay, I think the biggest danger is this Magister. Okay. Maybe we can knock down this Magister. Nice. Just to make sure Sibyl doesn't die. I don't think the others can reach her. I was wrong. Holy shit. Ay, ay, ay. Oh no! Oh my gosh! Panic! Yeah, this is honor mode. Yeah, this is honor mode. This is fine. Can I do this? Oh, I can only use this a limited number of times? Can I use this to kill somebody? Oh, it's only a corpse. Sorry. No, 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 this is tactician, not honor mode. Sorry, sorry, sorry. I, I, for some reason, I mixed uh, tactician and honor mode in my head. Yeah, no, 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 this is tactician. We are playing honor mode in Baldur's Gate. My bad. Sorry, I misspoke. Because my, I, I was trying to, to play and, and talk and, and the brain didn't, yeah. Okay, I think I just use a shield. Okay. This is really bad. This is really bad. I think he's gonna die. Oh no. He's actually doing some damage. Okay, this guy is bleeding. I think he's dead. Come on. We can try to kill this guy. So it's one last hitting the red prince. Nice! High five! She healed Fane? She... That's not good. Okay. This is fine. This is not fine. Fuck. I don't know what to do. I just know that whatever I do... It's gonna decide the fate of my fight. What I can do is try to teleport Red Prince up here. So that guy cannot reach him. It's probably the best thing I can do. What do you guys think? Because at least I'll teleport him to safety. In theory. Because... Teleport does damage, but uh, very little. Letting him die is... is really bad. Because the problem is that my initiative is too low. 
No, I cannot teleport the enemy to the sea, sadly. But you know what? Who acts next? That guy. Yeah, that guy would definitely kill Red Prince if I don't teleport him. I'll teleport him here. Okay. And then... I cannot resurrect anybody. I can throw a poison flask here. Shit, I killed one of my turrets. It's okay. I think we need to restart. Good thing I stayed right before. <sighs> no, no, no. I think we need to restart. Yeah, no, no, no. We can do better. I, I, you guys, I'm poor. I can't afford to resurrect my characters. That's the only problem. Yeah, I wasn't. I, I thought there would be a dialogue. Yeah, yeah. Hold on. Let me... Hold on. Let me sneak? Hold on. We are gonna put Iphan on the high ground. Like we did last time. We are gonna put Fane also on the high ground. Sibyl. I think Sibyl will send... No, we need to send Sibyl and the Red Prince together. Probably we'll kill this guy. Hold on. Um, Fane is gonna act... Do you guys think the fight will start if I come in this corner to summon? Hold on. Do you see Divinity? Hold on. Hold on. Okay. And then we'll buff this boy. And now... Oh, but there's no blood! Hold on. We can probably just summon a, another one in fight, right? It's okay. Hold on. No, hold on. I have a better idea. Fuck. I guess no ideas. Did I? No, you cannot push in this game. You cannot jump or push or throw. Wait, does iPhone have an ability to summon a wolf? Okay. Hold on. Hold on. 
Since we don't have blood to summon, what about... Go back here. This is Red Prince. Okay, let's do it. Hey! Mm, binary Viking, thank you so much for the 30 months! Thank you! Hi, dear friend! Oh, so close. Hold on. Oh, it would be so nice to teleport her. Or that person. Okay. We do. We do. We do. I've seen the etchings myself, mate. He's gone. You can fake an etching, no problem. I'm telling you, he no. wouldn't have done. We'll keep the high ground. Where's Sir Laura? Sir Laura's over here. Hey there, Viking. How are you doing? Yeah, I. I and no, we're in the very beginning of the game. Soon we can teleport even more. Hold on. Since Fane is first. Anyways. No matter what happens. Sabil is last. I think Sabil should start. We go right behind him and then we stab. And then the Red Prince goes in and stabs. And then Ifen shoots that guy. Nice. And then Fane will create the minion over there. Nice. Perfect. Now, Sabil can walk behind him. Oh gosh, I almost summoning summoned the minion behind. Okay, we'll take some blood. Gotta finish this guy. Can do this. Nice. We we'll take this. Nice. And now. I should actually save this. I should put myself in a more safe position. Because we cannot let Sibyl die. Let's just walk to high ground. How's that? Okay, this was much better. Was it? Oh, panic. This was not much better. Because I lost my minion. It's okay. It's fine. Yeah, Sibyl is... Sibyl is my favorite. I actually wish every character of mine was Sibyl. Do we fortify? Oh no. Oh no. Okay. This is fine. This is okay. I'm just getting fucked in the ass. Honestly, I'm better off just shooting them. He's gonna need to rescue the Red Prince. Wait, we, we can probably just... Uh... We can probably just heal him and he will be fine, right? I hope I'm right. Or should we rescue him? 
What do you guys say? Teleport him away? This monk will act, go behind him, and fist him right in the ass. But it's only one. And then there's this Magister, and then there's Sibyl. Nah, we don't have to. It's okay. We'll make a... Um, we'll make this instead. I, I... I'm honestly most upset. Wait, the monk? Okay, that's good that he... What the hell? That seemed personal. Oh, no. What fun things do we have? Blind them for two turns? That's the only grenade I have. I don't think it's worth it. Oh, they all have magic armor. It doesn't work anyways. Um... Dragorel, have fun. I love that game. You know what? Fuck this monk. Back down you go. This is fine. This is fine. This is okay. I could kill a monk, but then I would be stuck down there. I'm probably better off. Hold on. Doing this. And waiting until next turn. The prince is okay. The, the prince is okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Minus one? He's also low. I feel like the prince can deal with these. No, I should I should help him. Yeah. yeah I think we're done. Nice. I I love how they're ignoring. Why are they going for Fane? Or Sibyl? Well, I understand why, but. Why did I complain? Why did I complain? Why the fuck did I complain? This is fine. Okay, so there is this woman and this woman. And that woman. And then the red prince. Okay. If we don't get him out of there, he dies. Okay, so we're gonna do this. We cannot teleport him out of there. I don't know what to do. I could blind them. Do you guys think it's worth to make a smoke curtain on the Red Prince to try to get him to survive? Grease? What do you guys think? Your son is asking for the horse mask? 
Show your son soon. But I think he's dead anyways. I don't think we can save him. Holy shit. Shit! You guys are fucked! Yeah, I think I think smoking him is the best. Let's hope it works. I think I'll drink a poi uh, a poison. Yeah. It didn't work. Oh well. Okay. I think Sibyl. No, oh, done. I think Sibyl can kill this. I am so disappointed. You guys have no idea. <laughs> this is fine. This is so fine. No, you cannot throw an HP potion. Sadly, you can't. Okay. I should probably resurrect the prince with Ifen. Will his skills be on cooldown if he's resurrected? acting it's so hard for me to see shoe monks but I don't know who oh this guy and this guy Best place to put him. Probably here. Near the stairs. And then. I'll need to knock this guy down. So he doesn't kill her. I'm fading. Calculated. Have five. Okay, then we knock those two down. Jesus Christ. I am disappointed. I am so fucking disappointed. I'll give this is fine. Holy fuck! Mm. This is fine. Okay. We'll do this. I really miss my turrets. It, losing my minion, it was really bad. This could be any element, right? 
Oh, that's so bad. Ah, that's so bad! Fuck! I think I'll just shield up. Wait, it was an electric one? Oh, rip. I thought it was going to be blood. Oh, she run! She can go up! Oh, no. This is fine. Oh, poor Sir Laura! It's okay. I hate how my characters don't go down. They're all healing Fane. Okay. I need to kill those archers. Because this guy can use that AoE skill that spreads and hits everybody here. And then we're all dead. I have one more knockdown arrow. I think this is a great, great use for it. Because if I don't use this knockdown arrow, we're fucked. Okay. This is better. Now... We have to kill this... This guy. Focus. What the fuck? <laughs> Finally! <laughs> nice. High five! God! Yeah, Divinity is its own system. If you guys have any questions, let me know. I... So, so... Ah. Basically, you get... Uh, Access to things like um, like teleports and spells to teleport your teammates a lot sooner. Do I summon the cat? Is the cat any good? Does anyone know? What can the cat do? Meow? Okay. Meow? Meow? Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. This is fine. Did this ranger act yet? That one is knocked down. I think I need to kill this one. Like, I must kill this one. Fast as possible. Okay. Red Prince. We can kill this guy. Okay. And then we can hit this guy. How many times did I miss in this fight? A 95% chance. I think I'll make my minion. Uh... I think I'll make my minion stronger next turn. Wait, I should heal Sibyl. Since I heal Sibyl, I'll make my minion stronger this turn. Hopefully, this will be enough. Okay. I need to kill those rangers. Okay. 
path is interrupted. Shit. It's okay. I think I have other characters that act before. Okay. It's okay. It's okay. This this storage was a mistake. Okay, we're shocked. We're all standing in blood. So they can stun us all. Oh, I thought the other one acted first. It's okay. It's fine. You know what? I'm behind this, right? Wait, can I not hit this Inquisitor? I think the turret is right behind her, right? Hold on. Yeah, you know what? Fuck this. I'm going to teleport here. Lead. Kill this. Afar, hi! If the kids game the floor is made lava was a video... It's true. It's so true. You know how right you are. Okay, now we'll move behind this Magister. Get AP. Mwah, Bar, thank you so much for the four months. And hopefully we can kill this Magister too. Yes! High five! Okay, that was a great turn. Sibyl has a threat though. That's that monk. I think she'll be fine. Shit. Mr. Benito, thank you so much for the friend. Yeah, the floor is is fucked in this game. Do you guys think it's worth for me to use a grenade here? So that monk cannot reach the bill? Nah. We kill. I don't think they can reach anybody. That's fine. That's okay. Shit. Hold on. I don't think Sabil can do anything. It's okay. I don't think they can do anything, you know? Because the iFan can uh, do this. Yeah. Well, but now the Red Prince is kind of fucked. Because I don't have any ranged attack and iFan is blocking the road. I guess I just pass. I can fortify Seville. <laughs> That's probably a good idea, look. Nice. Let's go behind then. One high five! Woo! 
First try. Nice. Not even a sweat. Why is every fight in this game like it has me sweating? It's crazy. Yeah, so adrenaline... So, so adrenaline is different than action surge. Because adrenaline, I get... I, I borrow my action from the next turn. Wait. Are we close to saving G Garrick? Yeah, well, to be fair, only Red Prince died. And I feel like if he didn't die... Somebody else would have. Th there were way too many enemies. Yeah, you literally go into action depth. Uh, Savala. I, I have been an internet person since I'm like... Since like 15 years old. 15 years. And I always had a, a bunch of like... European friends. You know, so... My accent, I, I have, for the last 15 years, I have been speaking mostly English than Portuguese. And Magalhães, muito obrigada. Thank you for the four months. Thank you. Uh, you're asking about the pathing? It's because uh, I had my character standing right in front of the road. Yeah, 15. I think I started playing like games like with other people. I th I feel like my first online game was Diablo 2. I thought I was close to that guy. Hold on. I sound like Shakira. Now that's the first. I wish my hips were like Shakira. I hope I age like Shakira. There's a dead elf over there. Where the fuck am I? What is this place? There's a room over there. Uh, I don't know. I don't know. Because the honor mode in this game is like this. Except with only one save file. Do you guys want to go in here? I should probably level up. So tomorrow we'll go back to Baldur's Gate. We'll probably play Divinity. If not the day after, sometime soon this week. I'll let you guys know. We'll be playing both though, because I I, I I'm honestly loving this game. I, I can't believe the game made me cry twice today. So if you're on dead, you can lock pick up with your bony finger. Nah, Zenari, I don't know if I will go back to Red Dead right now. I just don't want to feel sad, if that makes any sense. I don't know, and I have the feeling that that game is going to make me feel really sad. I, I came here to find a guy, okay? But turns out he's not this way. And now I, I'm confused. Yes, I actually played the Baldur's Gate 2 right before playing Baldur's Gate 3. Replayed it. I played it for the first time when I was a kid. Um... If you go to my YouTube VOD channel, you can watch my full playthrough. I should probably level up. Hold on. Uh, so we can level... Wits. Mm. Yeah. Wits. Wits on Fane. And uh, Summoning. Red Prince, uh, definitely strength uh, and warfare, and that's it. In fact, when I played Baldur's Gate 2, I voice acted every line in that game. Is he here? What is this? One of the times I saw a little cry was because of something said in Baldur's Gate 3 that was a reference to Baldur's Gate 2 from a secondary character. 
that is very deeply sentimental for which the devs need to be recognized. Mocha, Baldur's Gate 3? Is this hell? Baldur's Gate 3 is full of references to, to things that happened in Baldur's Gate 2. And I love how well done those references are. Because uh, when they're poorly made, it reminds me of Final Fantasy. I didn't play the original Final Fantasy. So... So here. When I play... When I play the Final Fantasy remake... Hold on. Let me show you guys. I really appreciate how the references to the older games are made in Baldur's Gate because it doesn't put any new player in this situation. Okay. There is there is no there is no big spoilers, don't worry. So, yeah, I never played the original Final Fantasy games. And they put the character, that's the character that comes up later in the Final Fantasy games, in a place that it, it doesn't make any sense. It's literally just to please the fans. And in a deeply sentimental scene that I was worried about the kitties, I started questioning, why the fuck was Mickey Mouse in my screen? And I really appreciate that Baldur's Gate doesn't do that to people who didn't play the game. Because the way that they reference and they bring in the nostalgia for the old fans doesn't put anyone in this situation. And I, I, I find it to be fantastic. Because it, it's not exclusive to the people who didn't play the other games. Not the kitties! Is that Mickey Mouse? You know, it's not an inside joke or anything like that. I don't know. It's just, it's just more, it's more fitting. And I think that's one of the reasons why Baldur's Gate was so successful. Because it could inflict nostalgia on every old fan of, of the game. And at the same time, the people who were playing Baldur's Gate for the first time they did not feel like they were being excluded of anything. And I find that beautiful. I really love that. I really, really love that. Uh, Zenory. No. You know why this is different? It's because that character in Final Fantasy, at the point that Jahira looks at her daggers, you know who Jahira is. Jah you meet Jahira as a player. And Jahira talks to you, so sends you on a quest. So even that, in that point in Final Fantasy, that character... The character is not in a single point of that entire game. I finished that game and I still don't know who that character is. That character was never introduced to me. Not a single time in Final Fantasy. I will need to play the next Final Fantasy to, in hopes to know who the fuck Mickey Mouse is. That's the difference. So it's not the same. Valestan, thank you so much for the Prime. Mwah, thank you. Thank you. So it's very different, because when Jahira shows up and looks at the daggers, the pl any, every player knows who she is. How the fuck will I do this? Well, I will need you to teleport. I need to you go to this stone. Shab. 
I know, I know, Stephanus, and I really miss that. I, I, I'm really upset that there is no, there's a lot of references to Jan Jensen in Baldur's Gate. Zenery, but you, you know who Jahira is. You know that you're about to fight Keterik because it's in that cutscene, and Jahira could be looking at her weapons. And a new player that doesn't know about the old games, they might just think, oh, Jahira is getting you ready to fight. It still makes sense. It's not like a random, it's not like a pink elephant just showed up in the screen and, 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 and looked funny. How do you not see the difference? For, for me, the, the difference is very clear. Moshe, thank you so much for the three months of support. Valison, thank you so much for supporting Blackjack and a dead squirrel. Gods, what is that? <gasps> Whatever it is, it looks dangerous. Oh, my panic. There's a shrieker here? What is a shrieker? Oh, boy. What was the noise? Panic! Gareth! Wait, they're fighting! Shit, do I need to go there? Will he die? Holy fuck! Oh god! Oh god! Magisters, here. Holy shit. Holy shit. I Holy shit. Holy shit. Holy shit. Holy shit. Okay, okay, hold on, hold on. Uh, I have two of my characters in fight. Okay. Red Prince and Sibyl are not. Okay, I need to find where's the best place to put them. Because right now... Hold on. There's a fog here. There's a fight here. Hold on. We can't jump, right? So I think I will need to go from... From under. Okay. Oh, they fight indefinitely? Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Okay. Holy shit. Hold on. Okay, we got Red Prince here. Hold on. Woo! Not even close. High five! I know, I know. I, I love the hiding too. The only problem is that if I leave my two melee characters... Well, Sibylla can, can teleport, right? She has the high ground. But I don't think the field of view is good there. Hold on. Ah! It's pixel... This, this is pixel perfect. Okay. Okay. Now... We... Fight. Okay, perfect. Now... She has a still 87. E. Hold on. I can go here. And use the ram. No, I should save this. I should just attack this. Nice. Okay. 
I should have attacked the same guy, but it's okay. So, this Magister will go first, and then this one. Okay. Sphane's turn. No, this is gonna work. I, I, I hope. I hope. Is there any blood? Shit. No blood. No blood. Then we'll just... Uh... Do my turrets have line of sight? Yeah, I'll just throw it there. And that's it. Nice. Okay. She made the guy magic and then she ran off. And she's healing Fane. She took an attack of opportunity. Perfect. It's okay. Um, I fan. I wonder if I can only use... Gosh, my field of view is so bad. Okay, this is better. We shoot. Ay ay ay. I know, I, I love how the tail comes. I, I, I really love how... This game is like... Very funny. And silly. And it feels like it doesn't take itself seriously, but at the same time, it has the ability to make you cry and do a lot of things. <gasps> I'm fucked. Hold on. I need to get the executioner. So that's... I need one AP to get anywhere. I'll kill this woman. This is fine. I'm not sure if I can, but I'll try my best. No kill, but we can heal. I think I used that potion way too early. Yaref is in danger. It's okay. We go. It's okay. Now there is blood. Lots of blood. So now we can summon our fun summons. It's fine. Probably not. Shit. Maybe if I go over here, I can heal him. How's that? Nice. One dead, and we level up. Nice. Okay. Let's deal with this Magister. Nice. She heal. Okay. Right where I want you. Yeah, you you don't need to play the divinity games in the in the same order. W where is that guy going? What the fuck? Is he just running? Like, the guy just left his teammates? Just like that? Shit. The problem is that I can't do anything. 
Oh, he's coming around. He's coming all the way around? What the hell? I know, this game is great. Hold on. Oh no, they have a shield. Okay, we ram. And then we just attack. Nice. Wait, there was more guys here? I thought this was a separate fight. Oh my gosh. I like Divinity Original Sin 1 a lot as well. But Divinity 2 is clearly a better game. Just like Baldur's Gate 3 is clearly a better game than this. Well, in everything except the combat. The, the combat is still very good, don't get me wrong, but... You get it. Hold on. Maybe I should walk to these guys. Or maybe I should wait until they walk to me. In line of sight them. Depends where they come from. Oh no, Garrett's gonna ruin that for me. Isn't he? Easy. I love getting an opportunity attack because it gives you an extra attack outside of your turn for free. You know, just for free. Good stuff. Did you Valiant? I feel like in every other aspect, Baldur's Gate 3 is a better game than this one, except combat. I, I do think that the combat of this game is is better. Hold on. I think I'll use half of my... I, I think I'll use some of my AP to walk out. But I don't want to use everything. Because if I use everything, I'll just put myself in danger. Like this, they kind of need to work for me, you see? They walk to me and stop. If I go outside, they walk to me and hit me. And I can't hit them. And this guy... Maybe I should hit him. Nope. Maybe? Eh! Fuck. Okay, we can hit this guy instead. Oh, he coming! He's coming for us. Shield? Nah. We just attack. The music is made by the same person. I think both songs are amazing. I, I feel like it would be unfair to say that the music is better in this game because I feel like the, the music in this game is very nostalgic for me. <laughs> this acts no, thank you. Thank you so much for your prime. Thank you. Seriously, it means a lot. Hold on. We can walk here. A little bit more. Take this guy down here. Papa! I don't think he saw that coming. Ow. Magni, thank you so much! Ala Magni, thank you! Mwah, thank you! 
Oh, my panic. That was... Well, thanks for that. Okay. So Bill can walk behind this guy. And... Probably fuck him in the ass. Oh, but he has shield. Oh, cool. Oh well. I guess we'll need to remove his shield. Or do do we just walk to this guy and do more damage? I think it's better. Yeah, this is better. Wait, there's a way to go up there? <gasps> I need aid. <gasps> the Red Prince is dying. Fuck. He's burning. This is fine. I don't have a resurrection scroll. Shit. What can I do? That's really bad. I think Fane can heal him, right? Yeah, I think Fane can heal him. I mean, out of sight. Okay, let's kill this guy. I think I can, I can hope that the, that the AI is a little bit stupid and doesn't do the right thing that's attack re the Red Prince. It's honestly the, the only thing I can do. Premature celebration. I'm fucked. I'm actually fucked. I think he's gonna die next. Okay. 
What the fuck do we do? We drink this. We drink... Uh... Milk? Are you gonna be kidding me? Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Well... I'll drink more milk. And then I just walk out. Okay. I need to heal Sibyl. I can't. Healed the iPhone, but I guess I don't really care for iPhone. I need eight. Did you see that the AI shot at his friend to kill Sibyl? Did you guys see that the AI was smart enough? The AI could not see Sibyl. So they shot at its friend to AOE Sibyl. This game doesn't give a shit about your fucking feelings. This fight is literally, literally hell. We walk here. Gosh, Frodo, ooh, thank you so much for the prime. Thank you, thank you. Thank you, thank you! Jesus Christ! Can't let Gareth die. I think he will be fine. Okay, I only have Fane. I can take this guy and send him to Garrett. 
High five! Garrett, help! Yeah. Thanks! Oh no. Okay, this is fine. I think this guy's fucked. Your courage in the face of danger is inspiring, my friend. Lucian guided your blows rightly. Not even close. His eyes travel from your face to your feet, then back again. <laughs> You're clearly no magic. Garments First could have heard haphazard garb. How'd you come to <laughs> I don't think I have money to afford resurrecting my party, but you know, they won. Easy. Mwah. Thank you, thank you, Malice. Hey. One thing I wish Larian do is let you plan a move before you execute it. That would be fun. And maybe on the easier difficulties, I also let you undo. If you misclick and do something, to undo. Not on honor mode, but I feel like on the easier difficulties, it should let you do that. What do you guys think? Certain kinds of moves, right? Yeah, I feel like that would be good. But I, I, I assume that programming something like that is just really hard, right? <laughs> Cup of Eden. Yeah. I there's something telling me in my head that the undo button is very problematic. And it would never happen. But it it would have been nice. It would be problematic in, in like a bunch of ways, you know. I guess if you could undo things like movement, it would be fine, but not attacks. Yeah, maybe if you undo movement and not attack. You, you could undo before you attack. I am a sorcerer. I escaped from Fort Joy, and you are? Name's Gareth. I'm a seeker. I can give you shelter and hope. What? Shelter, hope, his penis, what else? Shelter? Do you mean the, the sanctuary of a major? You already know the place. Ah, good. Then you know us. And you know we can help you. And perhaps you can help us. What a rogue trader does that I really like is that when you enter combat, you, you have a pre-turn that you can place your characters within reason. You can, of course, place your characters on the opposite side of the battlefield, but within the area uh, in front of you, you can place your characters. And I think that would that, that's really cool. I really like that. Um, because then you don't... Uh, yeah, it, it's like you can deploy your character. So... Uh, but there is a, a small range, so instead of spending your first turn just walking to get to a place, it, you can actually get to the fire. Yeah, you can do that. Uh, yeah, you can do that if you if you know that combat's gonna happen and place your characters right. Um. Oh, I'll give your help and I'll take yours. Ooh. Your words warm my heart, sorcerer. Hi. Hi, hi. His eyes scan the horizon and then settle on yours. A moment passes. I can't stay. You shouldn't either. What did Lucian say? Ah, yes. Evil feasts on the indolent. Get yourself to safety and soon. You'll always have a place at the Seeker's table. Does he have Resurrection Scrolls? Ooh, 
Ooh, this helmet to warfare. Ooh. Oh, somebody's gonna lose a buck. So, what the fuck do I do now? Uh, Kaya, no, I, 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 I only played Rogue Trader one day, but I played it for like the entire day, and I, it was the same day that I streamed. I really like that game. I just didn't have the time. Uh, the reason also why I didn't play it again on stream, it's because uh, my voice has been. I, I have been streaming a lot, and my voice is very hurt. Hold on. I'll use the body of my dead teammate to hold items that I can carry. Yeah, Lone Wolf is really good, but I... Your shield speaks, Quirkus. Prick up your phantom ears. You guys, we'll be ending the stream here. Tomorrow we'll be playing Baldur's Gate. We'll go back to the 1 HP run. Uh... We will definitely come back to this. I, I, I'm, I'm having a lot of fun playing Divinity. It, it feels like a, a little bit more chill and more scary in some ways, you know? Yeah, yeah, I, can, I, I can't wait to play Rogue Trader. The problem is... Can I be honest with you guys? It's really hard for me to play games that are not voice acted. Because especially when it comes to strategy games, if I spend so much time reading, I become exhausted. And then I have to think in the fights, it's just too much. The, the, and then I just, I just can't play as much, you know? Especially on stream, it's just, it becomes nearly impossible. So, my only beef with Rogue Trader is the voice acting. Otherwise, I would have probably finished the game already. Yeah, I hate reading. I mean, I already have to read what you guys say. I read all day! I just can't handle any more of it. Mwah. Thank you. Thank it's the same problem that I had with Pathfinder. <clears throat> yeah. So, so... You know? Hey, yo. Mwah. You guys, have a good night. I need some rest. But, you know, six hours is printed by. Thank you. I hope you guys had fun. I, I had lots of fun. I love this game. Mwah. Hold on. I love this song. Um, A friend of mine, she came visit me, tell me about horse, ra uh, horse gambling. So... Lucky! Ooh, thank you so much for the Prime! L let's go say hi to her. She's doing a challenge run in Pokemon. She Everything in her, her Pokemon game is random. All the Pokemons are random. Her Pokemon is random. They all have random skills. It's all randomized. It's like the randomizer Baldur's Gate run, but in Pokemon. <laughs> I'll see you guys tomorrow. Tomorrow we'll play some Baldur's Gate. We'll, we'll arrive early on the stream because I think I'll make a vote. We'll either play one HP run or the randomizer. Maybe we'll make a vote. Bye! Mwah. Thank you! Thank you so much for the support! Thank you guys! Wait, wait! Thank you! Thank you! in chat if you don't have the emote it's okay use yeehaw say yeehaw oh, oh my goodness oh my goodness boo 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 hey say boo boo hey I need to go boogie You got my finger! Oh goodness! Vicious! Oh no, he tasted blood! Oh no, he'll come for my eyes next! Bye-bye! <laughs>